All right, chat. Shall we come in? Let's come into the games. Hey, Scary Brown. There he is. Looking mighty fine, Scary Brown. You looking like a sexy fish. But yes, I am very much liking um my new playlist. It's got, I think it's got 50 tracks on it, something like that. Um, look, it now says Monroe Sheriff's Office on uh, on Obadiah. Um, I'm a little concerned though, because I'm supposed to like have a separate Discord, right? For Red Dead for Law. But I can't, I can't, I, I haven't been given the role in it yet. So I still can't see any channels in there. So I'm like, am I missing stuff? I can't talk. Like there's no, I can't read the guidebooks or any of that stuff. All right. Let's get in on Scooter Brown. Continue my story. Thank you so much. Continue my stories. Oh, I remember I fell asleep behind this little rock here. It's fine. Audio jungle. I wonder how much that voice actor got paid for just saying audio jungle. Audio jungle. So I think, right, so you get these things. Busy B, floral and gifts. That's so fucking cool. But then I think somewhere, right? I know there's something down in Saint Denis. But it might just be that they use the icon for farming, but it's not actually... I think that's a tobacco shop? Yeah. Like, I don't know what you're supposed to do, basically, to... So, A, plant, and B, then sell stuff. So, I don't know. Oh, there we go. So, what can I do with the seed? I can plant it. I got the bucket. Hmm. So we've got to go and, I guess, go down to the ranch area. We'll see if we'll go down to the ranch, see if there's anybody there, and then maybe they can teach us. Because what I, what I don't understand, right, is like we got given the seeds and the bucket for free. So if you're able to just sell the sell the, uh, the produce at a shop, that wouldn't make sense because then how would the ranch make any money? I might change Pickle's tack, actually, because now I, now I know how to see the tack that you're getting. Wait, is that my son? I looked a little bit like my son. What was my son called? It was like Teague or something? Did That did look a little bit like my son, didn't it? Dude, he's gonna get some food actually. We got him. Okay, I got a bit of cash on me. How's it going? If I don't keep auto. Uh, yeah, I can get a shepherd's pie. Lower. Shepherd's pie, it'll be five dollars. Oh, riot. Yep, that's not my son. He's not Irish enough. That and I need fish. Um, I'm just gonna steal a rusty souls real quick and go to this other room station. I'll be right back. <laughs> There you go. Thank you so much. Thank you. Good day. You too. Howdy, uh, sir. Uh, howdy. I'm just going to saddle in here and try and decipher this menu. Well, good luck. Well, what you would you questions? recommend? You got a recommendation? Apple strudel, sir. Apple strudel? Yep. Oh, oh, my, oh, my. Apple filling? Mm-hmm. That's good. Mm -hmm. Sugar, okay. Mm-hmm. Sin yep, yep, sin yep. and nim and nim. Oh, that sounds yep. nice. Okay. And red crumbs. Sold. I will take an apple strudel. That'll be seven dollars. Seven dollars. Okay. My one, two. Okay, yeah, I got that. I got enough. There you go. I appreciate that. I'm I'm very hungry and all I got in my pockets are seeds. Oh God! Yeah, I don't need seeds, please. I'm ju I'm trying to learn how to farm. A nice gentleman gave me some seeds in a bucket yesterday, but I don't. I mean, I guess I put them on the soil and stuff. 
Yeah. That's good. Can I just plant anywhere in Monroe? Just in the street no, out here, no, maybe? No, 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 no. You no. need, like, a farmable patch of land. Oh, okay. Something like Emerald Ranch. Yeah, that's, that's the kind of people who gave me them seeds in a bucket. But sounds like Scooter Brown's taking a trip to Emerald Ranch. You mean the famous celebrity Scooter Brown? Uh, yeah, well, I didn't, I didn't want to say, but yeah, it's me, local celebrity Scooter Brown. Oh wait, you're a celebrity? Yeah, he is. What do you do, sir? Um, I live a long time and get old. <laughs> Oh, and I spread love and joy. That's good. Yeah. I, I had an idea that came to me today. Because of my extensive knowledge of Monroe, I might offer wagon tour rides. What do you think? Oh, that sounds like fun. Yeah. Like, look here. On your left is is a, a burnt-out house. And then I'll make up a story about how in 1832 a ghost set fire to it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You have somebody that rides past and then talk about that story and be like, yeah, I heard that too. Yes. Oh, I could get like other actors involved to, you know, embellish exactly. my stories. Exactly. Oh, that's smart. Or you, could, or you could like let people stage a robbery. Oh, this is getting a bit fancy now. Oh, I can't afford to em employ all these actors. Or you could actually let them rob the people. That's, I mean, that sounds a bit mean. I'm just... Oh, wait, hey, aren't <laughs> actors, like, super cheap and desperate? I don't know. I bet I can find some. They could work for the exposure of riding on my wagon with a celebrity. Exactly. Okay, it's coming together. Uh, uh, let me ask a, a follow-up, if I may. How much would you find gentlemen pay for a wagon tour of Monroe? Uh, well, it depends. What does it, in what does it include? Does it okay, include let's see. Food? Yeah, well, well, I could make a partnership with the saloon here, maybe. Uh, I would buy Wait. bulk strudels from you at a discounted rate. Uh, we'd start the well, tour here. Everyone you have to talk to Monty, though. Okay, it's okay. So we get sponsorship by saloons for strudels. We start <laughs> here so they get drunks in your bar. And then I ride them to St. Dennis. And, um... I talk about stuff and give them coffee, and then I rides them back here to get more drunks. Yeah. I, I give them about maybe, let's say, uh, 90 minutes of a tour. Yeah, that sounds good. Oh, oh what shit. The fuck? What, what do you want to drink? That's my friend Pete. Pete, get up off the ground, Pete. He doesn't. He doesn't seem to be doing okay. All yeah, that good. he has a, think, dr a drinking problem. I think Pete has just uh, he, he's taken just his last out. breath. Yeah. What? No, I, it's, I think, come on, Pete. I think he's done. Pete, don't die me again, Pete. It, he's I'm nearly, so sorry for your loss. He's nearly as old as I am, Pete. I'm so. I'm sorry. Hey, I'm check but, check my map where he came from. Okay. Let's see if you have a doctor in town. Come on, Pete. <laughs> Stay with me, Pete. Yeah. I mean, maybe one last hug, Pete. Come on. Yeah. He just needs some fresh air, I think. I think that's all it is. Come on, Pete. Hey, you shit on the scooter shoulder. Hey, look, there's Mrs. Pete. I'm giving him some fresh air. I, I, I think he's done for, sir. He's, wait, he's dead? Yeah. Well, waste not, want not, I suppose. Thank you, Pete. Just well, that take, was quick. Yeah, wow. well, you know, it's the secret to a long life is don't, you know, don't dwell too much on the sad things. That's true. That's what Pete would have wanted. What, for you to eat him? Yep. Yeah, he, he loved me very much, did Pete. You want to buy any Raven, sir, for the saloon? No, oh, thank you. Oh, damn. Okay. All right. So, 50 bucks for a tour ride. How's that sound? I reckon uh, I could sell it. If you could sell it? Yeah, sure. But okay. I, I, I personally wouldn't know. 
But I should, you, I gotta talk to Monty about Valentine Saloon sponsorship. Yeah, he's the boss. He, he owns the saloon. Okay, it's okay. All right, Scooter's formulating the plan. I'm gonna go plant my seeds and come talk to Monty later on. Yeah, he'll be a lot later on. Okay, that's okay. Scooter Brown, I mean, when you get to 67, you get prostate stuff. I tend to be up a lot. You got prostate stuff? What does that entail? Well, well, when you get, I mean, when you get a little older, the prostate blows up like a balloon. So What's a prostate? It's uh, the little fun button. Not everybody knows it's there. But it makes you pee in the evening time. Your bladder? Yeah, well, no, that, yeah, that makes, it's not, your prostate ain't your bladder. That's not the fun button. The, the where can prostate. You find it? Where can you find it? Yeah. Okay, there's nobody looking. No, ain't a lady's present. Okay. Okay, it's, it's, it's up your, um, you know where food comes out? Uh, no, it's not. It's, you, it's you, up there? Yeah. How, how do you know this? How did you learn about this? I'm 67 years old. I know everything. But it gets, you know, when you get older, it gets angry. And it, it's, it, it makes you pee because it pushes against your bladder. That's why old people get up so many damn times. I mean, I feel like I need to pee right now. Please don't pee your pants. I won't, I won't pee these pants. You have a pair of pants that you purposely pee in? What? Don't you? No. Well, what pants do you pee in? I don't, I don't, in, in, none in any. I remember those days. You hold on to those days. You hold them on to tight. They'll go faster than you think. Um, yeah. I pro I won't wear the pee. <gasps> I need to get a special tour guide's outfit, don't I? I can't wear my pee pants for that. No, no, you cannot. Okay, so I... Do, you, do you even have a wagon? Uh, no. I, this is uh, day one of Scooter Brown's Monroe Tour Emporium, so okay. I got a lot okay. to do. Yeah. So I need a wagon, a fancy coat. Hello, sir. Can I interest you in a tour of Monroe? No. Okay, he's out. Or come my sales he, pitch, too. He just doesn't know who Scooter Brown is. Yeah, yeah, ignorant man. I know. It makes me sad whenever I meet someone who hasn't had Scooter in their life. <laughs> so, how are you going to be able to afford this uh, wagon? I mean, what do they cost? Like 20 bucks? I think it's one in the range of 200. Shit. Okay. Well, my son, who I met yesterday for the first time, said he earns like six, seven hundred bucks doing farming. Who would that be? Oh, I forget my son's name because I'm a terrible father. Uh, he was Irish too. I think his name was Teague. That would have been uh, Teague. Yeah, he prefers Teague. It's my little fatherly nickname. Well, I hope you find him again. Me, me too. It took me 67 years to find him the first time. You wouldn't know where this Teague is, would you? Well, I just met him yesterday at the ranch. That's the only time I saw him. We had a wonderful conversation about love and math. Oh, I am very good at math. Uh, I can only count to ten. Yeah, that's, well, you need to take off your boots. That's what I was teaching Teague. My boots? Yeah, it gives you another ten to count on. You are a very wise man. I would have never thought of that. It must be your old age that gives you all this knowledge. It's just all the wisdoms. It does sound like this might be Teague. But now I feel I must go and plant my seed at the ranch. Yeah, I'll see you later. Oh, see you later, buddy. And get my later, business Russell. off the ground. Well, you go do that. I'm sure you'll get loads of money working down the Emerald Ranch. I will do my best. You gentlemen, have a fine and a scooter brown day.
You as well, sir. We Open will. Your pants now. All right, hey, hey. Stay, stay safe. Morning, partner. <laughs> I don't know if I just confused the fuck out of them. <laughs> that was that, Tyg. I don't know. He sounded a bit like he didn't sound Irish, and then he started to sound Irish towards the end, and I was like, "Wait, is it?" But I don't think it was because the guy who was playing playing my son yesterday was was like really good in like back and forth chat. So maybe not. Not sure. Oh, they're spreading education about men's sexual health chat. That's how it works. All right, come on, everybody. We're going to the ranch. He does sort of have an appointment, Donkey Kong. We've got a telegram, uh, Marianne. Oh, hang on, no, it's over this way. Um, but I don't know how long I'm going to be on chat. I'm going to do a few hours this afternoon and then have a break. Eat some... Well, no, I'm not eating because I'm fasting today. But um, I'll do a couple of hours of scooter, have a break, and then we'll either be back on as scooter or Obi tonight. But I don't really want to come back on as Obi until I've got all my admin stuff sorted with lore. Another channel? Yes, glitched. You clearly haven't been paying attention. Still got to find Mariana, husband. I mean, I'd rather find her a microphone. I'll be honest, because I want to. I want to role play with her. But it was a bit rough yesterday. They're just those. But it's it's one of those things, chat, where it genuinely like at points that was it was hurting my head. So, like I couldn't cope with that. Um, but honestly, I hate to say it. There's also the stream side of things, like. I don't I don't want that kind of audio coming out on what I produce. Scooter is a goddamn machine. See what I mean though about the bow and arrow? It's so much more accurate than like a proper bolt action rifle. It's really annoying. <laughs> but also he's 67 years old, Wes. He knows how to shoot a bow. I mean, I've had a fair amount of experience, to be honest, learning roughly where the middle of my screen is from all the... Because Wild never had a crosshair either. Oh, what a surprise. My Scooter Brown video can't be monetized. I'm going to have to go and appeal that and inevitably wait for... Oh, look, what a, what a surprise. It's been copyright struck. Yeah, you just aim at the middle. It's fine. It'll get released. It's just a pain in the ass. Doom, do do doom. At least it's not the C word again. That was so good, though. I love that. Maybe Scooter should go into law. <laughs> and you have to lead the shots with the arrows as well.
Yeah, but he would only use a bow and arrow. That's it. And he would refuse to arrest anybody because he doesn't want to be that mean. Please, somebody clip that. That is the best shot I think I will ever do, ever. Look at... Look! Straight in the back of the head. Jesus, Scooter, you're a savage. I think this will be stream number five, chat, to get affiliate. I feel sorry for that other person on the horse because like, sorry, I've taken all the deer. But yeah, I assume like, <sighs> I don't know. I don't like whether or not you owe no, because I'm trying to... Sorry, chat. I'm, I, you're getting a stream of my consciousness right now. They didn't take my name at the ranch, okay? So it's not like they could track me down for who owes them money. I didn't pay for the seeds or the bucket. So I'm, try, I am, I'm just trying to figure out how, how they make any money and what I'm supposed to do with all these crops. But she did say something interesting, like, can you make sure you wash the potatoes first? I don't really know what that means, unless that was just pure roleplay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. I gave them... Well, of course, I mean, they know who I am, don't I? Because I'm the local celebrity, obviously. Yeah, yeah. Little Blue, thank you for the follow. Welcome on in. I'm really looking forward to getting back to Pacific Drive tomorrow, chat, on the main channel. Oh, no, I should start calling it the Variety Channel, maybe. Now, on other servers I've been on, this little patch here was set up as a community farm. That little strip of dirt there. But I'd rather go to the ranch, actually, see if somebody's around. Oh. Is that a deer? That is a deer. I was like, is that a horse? The great thing about arrows as well is that if you don't miss, you keep them all. I scared the man on the wagon. Click. I was like, oh, how have I still got 20 arrows? And I'm like, oh, no, yeah, you pick them up, don't you? No, oh, more fun music for Scooter. Or at least relaxed for Scooter. Scooter. Come on, fake pickle. I really want to get over to Guama though, because if you think this game is pretty on the mainland, fucking hell, you should see some of the views on Guama. Absolutely insane. Just a nice, relaxed ride with Scooter Brown. A very merry Sunday to you all.
All right, let's see. I don't think there's anybody here. Let's pop around to the stable. 10 year old cat and a 10 month old cat chasing each other around like lunatics. That sounds like fun, Idris. That's not a problem. That's just a good time. Okay, so. The Emerald Ranch stables there. Wolves Den. I don't really know what kind of shop that is, though. Gonna have a little look see. Not quite sure what the paw print shop is. Tanner, like that kind of shop, maybe? Oh, nice. Foot fetishism shop. That sounds like that's right up Scooter's alleyway. see if it's inside but it might be one of those shops that isn't open until um the player comes yeah okay only pause uh oh i didn't eat my strudel did i ah oh, let's go and have a little stand up on the um on the nice tree here and eat my strudel let's get I need to get scooter some cigars hey you're right Hello. This is a beautiful little spot, isn't it? Oh, wow. Okay, that does fill you up well. That's good. We like that. Come on, Scooter. Show a little skin. Not sure if there's a water point at Emerald, actually. Look at our boy. I love Scooter Brown. He's just, you know, happiness and easiness. Oh. Oh. Oh, no, there we go. I love Red M, but it's not the stablest thing in the world. So anytime there's like a little glitch where it pauses, you're like, wah, wah. Okay, let's see if we can find a little spot at the ranch here to try out our little crop growth. I am the Bob Rush. Of Monroe. Alright, let's go. Like, I don't want to go into this dirt bit here. Oh, no, actually, if I remember rightly, there's a couple of little sectioned bits the other side of this area for grazing. Hey, Lens! Like, these sections here. to this lamppost. No. Okay. Okay, that's good. Oh, shit. Now I need some water, though. That's a good point. We need water first. Well, Linz, we, we did think today maybe Scoot is going to start a little tour company is dry oh that might be deep enough okay if it's big enough to 
deep enough to do my flask, it should do the water. Oh shit, okay, that's over encumbered us by quite a bit. I should go to Brown and get up this hill. Uh, uh, my old aching bones. Oh, it's Pete. It's Pete's meat. <laughs> hey, you want to buy Pete's meat? It's real tasty. Got 18 cuts of venison on me, chat. I love Scooter. I'm, I'm glad they added the mechanic, though, to to make it a full, you know, a heavier bucket, because they don't always. All right, what are we growing? We're growing potatoes. So let's try and use this little patch here. I, I have no idea how this works, chat, so... Let's see what happens. I also don't know how long the potatoes take to grow in game. All right, so plant. There is no use for this seed here. Okay, so. Do you need a shovel? Maybe? Do you need a shovel first? Do you have to dig a hole? Mm mm. Need to find a potato plant? Maybe. There's like, there's nothing marked. Oh, hang on. I think I see a player. Howdy. Uh, hello. How you doing? I'm doing good. Uh, it's, it's me, Tyke. Tyke! I've been looking for you all morning, son. Oh, really? Well, well, no, but you know, I wanted to feel fatherly. Uh, well, yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, I'm, I'm. By the way, I met a fella in Valentine who I think was looking for you, and it maybe it's my instincts, but he didn't sound like he was looking to be kind to you. Really? What? Did you catch his name? No, I, I, bizarrely, I thought he was you. Initially, he looked just like you, but he was wearing, like, red and black. He had that same right. kind of short, dusty blonde hair. Well, he, he wasn't wearing the same... That sounds like a very dangerous man. I know. He he. I worried He worried me because I said that I, I had met a lovely young... Well, I said I had met my son for the first time. And uh, uh, he seemed to be interested in your whereabouts. Yeah, uh... I think I'll keep an eye out for this man. Yeah. But not. I haven't really made any enemies yet, but maybe I have indirectly. Yeah, I was I was concerned. He looked like the sort of a man who would twirl his mustache in a way that would make you uncomfortable. I see what you mean, yeah. Yeah. And he didn't seem overly interested in my wagon tour rides, which I'm starting up, so can't trust that neither. Oh, wagon tour rides? What's that about? I'm thinking maybe I get a wagon, I take people on a tour, I, f I get them good and drunk and feed them apple strudel. Show them the sights of Monroe. Right. You know, like, um, um, we could come by Emerald Ranch and I'd be like, this tree here is the haunted ghost of Esmeralda Beach House. Wow. She that died. That would be really good. Yeah. I think it's the same character actor, you know, Jack. Get good and drunk and then you can get more of their money off you. Well, that's what I'm thinking. But I think, it, you know, maybe 50 bucks. I'll take him on an hour and a half tour down to St. Dennis. Yeah, that's a pretty good deal, actually. Yeah, I know, right? It's good entertainment. Your own, your own personal, personal stagecoach plus drinks. I'd See? pay 50 for that. There you go. I got them you, business smarts. You've got, yeah, you have a real business idea coming up. I'd say that'll be successful. I hope so. I just got to get the money for the, the wagon. Though, speaking of which... I got these seeds in a bucket from yesterday. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I tried to put a potato in the ground over there, and uh, we said I couldn't do it. My fingers just wouldn't let me. Ground is too. Uh, ground is way too hard over there to be planting anything. Yeah. Do you it's know? It's just sand and stone. You know how? What? I gotta find a nice grassy patch or what? Yeah. 
Uh, there's actually one right over there. Oh, I showed you. Yeah, that'd be great. I was trying to figure out how them folks make any money because they just gave me free seeds in a bucket. See, what they actually do is you are working for them, so they give you the seeds and buckets for free, but you have to give it back to them, uh, like the harvested crops, and then they give you money for it. Oh, so they buy the crops from me. I kind see. Of, in a way. I see. Or they, oh, yeah. they kind of pay me for the crops, but it's... They pay you to do the work. I see. What I'm saying. I got you. So I don't go selling it, no shop or nothing. No, they'll fire you immediately and bar you from working here. Okay, understood. Uh, do I need a shovel or can I just use my bare hands? Oh, no, the ground's soft enough to use the bare hands. Plus, you have a rake on you as well, which will work. I, oh, shit. Do I need a rake? No, no, no. You have it. Just trust me. You have it. Oh, I, I just feel it in my soul. Yeah. Okay. You see, you must be my son. You're so wisdomous, too. I know. It's almost fate that we met like this. Hey, do you know the man I met in, in, my, met in Valum my time? He didn't know how to count to 20 neither. Did he not? No, I told him about well, the boots thing and now I wish I hadn't done it. Oh uh, no, too much information. I know. You can I use got, that for evil purposes. I gotta keep my secrets, you know. Family secrets. Uh, uh follow me real quick. You got those buckets on you, don't you? Yeah, I, I already filled it with water. It's, it's fucking heavy. Oh, uh, that's perfect then. Right, over here. Well, sir. It's definitely the same uh, character chat. <laughs> I say this is going to start. Yeah, okay. I take my potato. So, first thing you want to do is pull any weeds out of the ground. All right. Rake in the ground. All right. There you go. Hey, here's the rake. It was inside of me all along. Exactly. Right next to my fun button. I'm sorry, fun button? Oh, it's a, it's a whole Valentine thing. I was trying to give uh, sexual health edumacations. I wish I could use that in my youth. Yes, I mean, it's, it's tricky, you know. You got plenty of time, though. There you go. There's the weeds. And you just plant the crops in there. All right, you can go, little potato. Okay, I... Oh, there you go. Oh! Holy uh, shit. Not harvestable yet. It'll give it time. We need to water it, nurture it, love it. But soon enough, you'll have a good potato. So, do I? How do I? Do I chuck some water on it now, or? Uh... Oh, you'll you'll have to wait a bit. Okay. It's, it's already too thirsty. Goddamn thirst trap. Okay. I can. Yeah. I put another potato like here. Oh, there's so many. Look, come here. Just come here. The advice I was given is to walk four steps away to give the roots enough time to grow. Because okay. if they're too close, then the roots entangle and the plant will die. So you go one, two, three, four, and then you plant right here. Okay. You one, look at that for me? two, three, four. Stop. Okay. Uh, uh, a bit closer would be fine, but that works too. Hip. Don't worry. Oh. Yep. Oh. You go okay. and grab your rake now. Uh, okay. Here we go. Hey. Perfect. Did you hear my friend Pete died? Pete? Who's your friend Pete? He was a bird. Oh, how long have you had him for? 67 years. You grew up together? Yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. He came into that. the saloon for one last drink and just died. Oh, poor birds. I'm so sorry for your loss. It's okay. He tasted nice. I'm sorry? What? Okay, that's potato in the ground number two. All right, let's keep going with the potatoes then. Another four steps. One, two, three, four. I don't even have to take my shoes off. Nope, nope. That's the, that's the good charms of doing being a farmer. You don't even need to count to ten. Actually, you do. Our lad. The advice I was given was to plant 20 crops at once. So, guess what? You're going to be taking off those boots to keep counting. Oh, goddamn. Okay. It's okay. I got Just... uh, feet like wood. This is some serious mathematician ish stuff. Okay, here you go, little seed. 99. You have a rest up. Okay, now, hang on a second. Let's just, uh. Oh, come here. Sit on. Alright, let me take these boots off if we're gonna be getting up to some minis. 
Okay. Here, I'll take those for you. All right, there you go. Don't mind the sores. It's fine. Ugh, okay. Yeah, okay. It's just their well-worn feet. That's all. Okay, look at this. Oh, hey, there's another fella doing plantings. Oh, yeah, he's wearing all black. That's probably too hot for him. Hey, wait, he looks a little like the suspicious man. Oh, you said he was wearing black and red. I did. Okay, hold on. Check I... him out. Shh. They like. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> he's wearing glasses. He looks like me. He has shorter hair, but it's definitely blonde. I think that might be our man. I will defend you with my life. Uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna stay down low. He probably won't notice me if we just keep working. You can we'll hide in my potatoes. Problems. Exactly. One, two, three. Out, thorn. Oh, what happens? Uh, it's just a thorn on my foot. Oh, uh, don't worry. You, you said you have feet hard as wood, right? Yeah. I'm pretty sure at this point in time they're about 87% bunion. Oh, buns. I like a good bun every once in a while. Uh, are you making that one of them sex jokes? What? No, no, no. I just like buns, you know? Bread. Love it. Oh, yeah. A nice loaf. Nice loaf. A bit of gravy on it. Oh, damn. Scooter Brown's getting hungry. All right, let's start with a new row in Tyler. I think that'd be good. Okay, so I could go like forward this way. Forward that way, perfect. Okay. One, two, three, four. And then you go back the way you came. This is a nice ranching system. I've had a bit close to all the of the dirt, so I'm gonna watch out. Okay. Oh, it's getting hot. Hold on, I need to. You don't want to die of the heat stroke. Oof. I mean, I don't want to stop you from getting on with your work, neither. You don't have to keep your old paw company. It's okay. No, no, no. I've just finished farming myself, so I've got time to spare. Well, thank Plus, you. It's always good to be do something uh, with your father. That's true. Bondage. Bonding. Not bondage, please. What? What's? Is that different? That's that's a sex type thing. Oh! Oh, that's bad. Bonding. Okay. Bonding. There you go. Damn, words are tricky. That's why I don't speak much. Well, you know, man of few words is very wise. Only speak when you have something of value. Very, very true. But you talk a lot. Well, that's because I'm fucking smart. Ah, uh, I see. Everything that comes out of Scooter Brown's mouth is 100% prime wisdoms. I mean, that's true, shown by a new business idea. One, two, seven, eight. Plant. Okay. There was a man at the saloon who suggested that I would uh, uh, collaborate with men of ill intent and they would rob the wagons while I took them on a tour. What? It seems unscrupulous. I think he just lacks faith in humanity. I agree. I can see, I can see the good people. I can tell you're a good person. I can see even the worst people have good in them. And That's... I'm sure nobody would rob such a fine business as yours. You got, you got a lot of faith in humanity. Well, well, if I don't have any faith, then what's even the point? That's true. I'll just give up. Don't give in to the darkness. Are you sure you don't want to take that coat off? You seem to be getting a little bit hot. I am a, a little moist. I can see the sweat coming off your brow. I'll get this one in the ground then, maybe I'll... Oh. How many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
Hey, okay, so I'll get one more and then Scooter Brown needs to take a whiz. Alright. I'll just be waiting over by the tree for a... I don't really want to see all that. Two, three, four. A little more. There you go. There you are. Okay, my age is coming up fast. Let's see. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, and that'll be ten. Always not to ten with your feet. I say I that again. Tell me, you have another ten to go. Oh. You gotta start counting with your feet. Oh God, where's? Oh yeah, I took my boots off. Okay. I need an IRLP. That's the only problem. You're a natural farmer. Look at you go. Look at that. I knew. See, I, what did I say to you yesterday? I said I probably did it at some time in my 67 years, but the you know the drink but you problem. Know, muscle memory stays forever. It's, That's what you have right now. It's true. Okay, I'm just gonna go uh, take a whiz by that cow, and maybe puke a little bit. All right. You I'm, go enjoy yourself then. I'll be back in a minute. Oh. <sighs> That's, that's not the same player, is it? Because I think that other guy is the same guy, but I feel like maybe they're brothers or something, IRL. I don't know, because that's great. All right, Scooter Brown's going to take a leak, chat. I will be, I'll be. Oh, hey, a man is peeing here. Oh. Asshole. All right, now I'm peeing. Scooter Brown, where are you at? Scooter? Now where in the world is he? Okay, I'll buy the cows. I just heard his voice. I think he's lost me, isn't he? <laughs> it's alright, I can give him lessons on stealth. I think the scooter's bladder was that big. Uh, uh, uh. I'm sure that's where you went. Yeah, sure, it takes a while when you get to my age. Oh, I feel better now, go. if not a little damp. Uh, I'm sure you'll be grand. Okay, so. Uh, by the way, I put your boots up at the top there. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, that's a bush. Seven, eight, nine, tens. Okay, I'm I'm ready. One, two, three, four. There we go. So, how how much are they gonna buy twenty potatoes for? Um, 
I do not know actually. All I know is if you farm the 64 seeds they gave you, they'll give you $64. A dollar a potato? A dollar a... I can't fit. Well, I suppose all I got to do then is four rounds of crops and I've got enough for my wagons. Yeah, you would actually. Uh, what are they, like 200, 300? Yeah, something like that. I got a little bit of money in the bank, but not much. Mm. One, two, three, four. I sure, that'll be a day, two days work. It's not much in the grand scheme of 67 years. Exactly. You got another at least 30 to go. Oh, minimum. Minimum? Yeah, I'm going to live, uh, I reckon, till 172. 100 and I don't think that's even possible. Don't challenge me, son. You want to bet on it? Yeah, okay. All right. $50, $50 that you'll live to 100, that you won't live to 172. Okay, I'll take that bet. I have some action. All right. One, two, three, four. That means if you die before your daddy, you got to put it in the wheel. Gentlemen's bet, shake hands. Oh. You can just, I mean, you can tap my hat if you want. That's how we used to do it. That's it, a gentleman's agreement. Uh, you, you know, your man that came over that you thought was the other guy in Valentine? Yeah. Yeah. Very, very suspicious. He tried to sell me something. He didn't say what it was. Or is he running too so fast? Oh. I don't trust people that run everywhere. Uh, don't, don't don't look at him. Don't look at him too long. Ah! Oh. Uh, no, no, no. Oh. Okay. Not remember? I was going. He's the one that's after me, right? I was going to disarm him with friendliness. Uh, I don't think that's gonna really work. You know, I have faith, but not that much fucking faith. Okay, but I also have a gun. Okay, that's not. Uh, that's no. not. Oh. Just just put that to put that. Okay. There you go. There you go. That potato seed was looking at me funny. That's all it was. Right. Let's let's get you focused on your potato farming after that. <laughs> it's like he's taking his granddad out. So our habits die hard. I used to be um in the wars. Used to be a gunslinger in your time? Of course. I've been a little bit of everything in my time. <laughs> Being a hunter too, I guess. As well since I'm guessing because of that bow. Yeah, I mean, hot damn, I got 18 cuts of venison on my horse just from the ride here from Valentine. Well, I have 19, so I beat you. Okay. My son See? has surpassed me. It's like the passing of the torch. And soon, I'll you in your foot, so Scooter boring. Brown will be irrelevant and you will become the local celebrity. No, you won't be irrelevant. You'll be a hero in our hearts. I mean, I, we, I've still got 105 years to go, so I'll practice my bow. I may not even be that there around that long. And then I'll be 50 bucks richer. Ah, uh, but you'll be a son poor. What's, what's, isn't that true value? I mean, that's true. You are priceless. Okay. No. Is, I got room that, this way. That's fair enough. Yeah. Four, eight, four, around the bush, count to four. One, two, oh, three, four. There you are. So, oh, if, me... if I'm planting 20 crops and he's planting 20 crops, that ain't going to cause problems, right? No, no, no problems. You can have, you know, five people around here. Roots won't get entangled or nothing. Oh, that's great. Yeah. How do these uh, plants fare in the storms? I got to make sure I've harvested before a storm comes. Uh, I would not know about that. Well, it's time for science. <laughs> I don't think you want to be losing 20 crops over to the storm. You know, destroying them, setting on fire and whatnot. Well, that's true. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll do a science with one crop. 
That'd be a good idea. Yeah. Anyway, how have you been, son? What have you been up to since I saw you yesterday? Well, I went for a meeting with a professor, Gustav Freitag. Uh, it was about, I'm writing uh, wildlife books. And I was just asking him questions about different wildlife and their habitats and whatnot. It was very boring stuff, trust me, but you know, it was very helpful to me. Hey, there's nothing boring about having passion, son. That's what people will be drawn to. God, you are just full of wisdom today. What am I going to do? Hey, hello, nice to meet you. What are your passions? I don't have any. Oh, well, you're boring as fuck. See how that works? <laughs> I see now. Yeah, I see. Whereas I could sit with you for hours and talk about the wildebeests. Now, I've only been in New Hanover, but I'll be spreading my wings out going all over Amberino and New Austin. Well, do it. I will, I will buy that. Well, no, I will autograph a book for you and you can sell it. Uh, that's a good idea. We'll build a business empire, you and me. Because then maybe at the start of one of my books, I can uh, advertise your business. That's smart. I could write you a forward, you know, like Teague has been my son for 67 years and I have never known someone more knowledgeable about leaves and stuff. Exactly. This is all can, coming together. You know, you can tell me when you're doing your business, what times you'll be in Valentine and I'll set up shop right there and you can show it off to them and they'll buy off me. Oh, and we could do like first, first two people to buy a wagon ride get a free book and that will lure yeah, them in yeah, and then the yeah. others will be like hey i want a book too and you'll be like well it's ten dollars should have been faster exactly you are a genius yeah i know it's how i live so long but you're very not good at being fucking straight with your planting though just well, look at that being straight is born you gotta go with the flow, I guess. That's how I know about the fun button. What? Why is the fun button? <laughs> oh, you'll find you'll learn that lesson in time. All right. Well, I think you've just done twenty now. If you want to count. Okay. Come on, toes. I get this little baby potato seed in. Right, let me let me take my boots off, actually. <laughs> I mean, what you call it? Record players do exist. Uh, there we go. All right. All right. We could uh, we could both count and then compare our tallies. All right. Let's let's do that. Then. Okay. Okay. One, One two, 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 three, One, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven eight, eight, nine, ten, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okay, just get the toes 16. in. One. Two, I 17, 18, 19, 20, had the pinky as a big toe. Okay. Right, I got my number. Okay, I got my number too. Say it All at right. the same time. Yep. Okay, one, two, three. 34. 23. Oh. oh. We are good at math. Uh, they call that a, st a statistical irrelevancy. It's fine. I'd say 34 is the right number, actually. I'm yeah. not good with counting with my toes yet. Yeah, it's the webbing, right? The webbing of the toes. Yeah. Exactly. Throws me off. I think I might have an extra toe grown in somewhere, but, it, you know, it'd be fine. That's okay. It's them Scooter Brown jeans. Or maybe you probably have a couple of bunions that look like toes, actually. Yeah. I call them my fun toes. Little snacks. When... All right, let's get to... Oh, don't throw your boots on there. Just grab these. Uh, come on, down we go. We throw mine on there now. All right, here we go. Uh, uh, oh, right. oh, comfy. Let's get to wiring. Okay, let's get my buckets. I wonder how I do this. Oh, come on. There we go. Uh. Elio. There you go. Right onto the soil. 
right in the center. Drink it up, little potato. Another thing we have to do afterwards is wash them in the river stream over there. But we'll do that in a minute. I can see how this will take a while. <laughs> yes, it does take. No, yeah, mumbly. Uh, usually takes, you know, all day. But it's not a bad way to spend a life outside in the sun and the peace. Oh no, I can't hear him. Might have to speak up, son. Scoot Brown is deaf as a... Oh, he's gone. My imagination again. Whoa! Oh, oh, oh! My imaginary son! It's not like this guy. There's clearly something right between these two characters. There's been too much crossover between what they say to for them not to know. Is my bucket empty? Oh no, okay. There's too much crossover. Yeah, maybe, Yukina. Maybe. Either way, it's fucking great. I love it. Oh, my bucket empty. Ah, uh, okay. I am gonna... I know I said I don't like running when you don't need to run, but we've got to get these crops... Um, planted and harvested before um the server re restart plot twist he's lurking in chat maybe who knows i don't there we go but i genuinely chat i hope you don't mind it but a lot of scooter brown streams may be farming um because you know these streams are meant to be chill for me as much as anything and i i love just the meditation of bimbling around doing crops uh is that that's his crops isn't it boobalicious thank you very oh bobalicious thank you very much for the follow i thought it was alec coming in then with starting the new boob meme nice variety yeah because obi is all whilst obi as a character is calm like the streams will certainly be um more dramatic for sure Do we only get like three um, buckets? Well, because you know Alec was donating one pound fifty-four as a hilarious meme. Okay, I'm confused. No, these are my potatoes, aren't they? They've just grown, I think. I'm so confused. Um. So now Alec was saying that he's going to... Because changing the meme to 8008 for boobs. And start donating like £8.8p 8 instead of £1.54. <laughs> Boobalicious is also good. Either way, welcome in, Bob Boob. Bob Boob. A Bob Boob. I did watch Top Gun last night, Jap. It was, it was, to be honest, it was perfect for a little sequel. I'll be honest. Okay, so that, yeah, that's definitely them growing. Do you have to water them twice? We are sex bob bob, sex bob boob. Tax man's gonna love Jay. Well, thankfully, it all just comes in. Uh, it doesn't, I don't track every individual donation. It's all tracked like. Here's how much came in this month in donations. Because it all comes from one source from my side of stuff. It's either a Twitch, it's either a Streamlabs payout or a, um, come on brain, or a PayPal payout. Okay, so those have been watered. Do you have to water them twice? It does look like we might have to water them twice. Yeah, it's either they need twice watering or they just need a bit more time. But I do have a Discord request, which I'm going to guess is from. Uh, 
Uh, you, yeah, in theory, you could carry multiple buckets. Um, but yeah, it would probably be too heavy. You could probably do it if you didn't have much else on you. Alright, cool. Yes. Um, Teague is confirmed. Thankfully, it's just, yeah, the watering can show up twice as a bug, so we're all good. I got like 25 minutes to get these harvested though. It's gonna be a little close. Lola, I love you, sweetie, but no. Ah, oh, did you hear the little meow as she came past the microphone? <laughs> no, PayPal doesn't take tax here, Yukina. How can they take tax? They don't know what rate to take the tax from you at, surely. How does PayPal know what tax rate you're paying? Or even if you owe any tax? Badoom. Scooter would never be so mean to a donkey oracle. <laughs> Yeah, this is a fairly similar ranching script to other places I've seen, but it's a lot more fluid than I've seen in other places, that's for sure. Because you've got that bullshit sales tax thing, haven't you? That makes absolutely no sense to anyone other than the American government. Is that cow giving birth? States' rights to collect extra taxes. That's all that freedom you got to pay for. Yep. I don't know what I'm going to do today, chat. I'm going to stream Scooter for a bit and then I might... <sighs> I probably should not stream more tonight. I don't know. I'll see how I feel. I do need to take some fucking time off. <laughs> yeah, apparently. <laughs> but equally, I'm not quite sure what I'd do. I'd probably just binge X-Men. I'll be honest. Like, I don't need to stream again today. Like we've We've got the stream in for today. see how long these take to be ready okay but jay you want to rp why does it feel like you're going but you want to rp look into my eyes look into my eyes not around the eyes look into my eyes i do i do want to rp ob but i need to in fact, while we're waiting for these crops to grow, let me send this DM. Um, let me have a quick. Because basically, I'm in the law Discord for Ranch, but I don't see anything. Um, and there's like a roll request thing, which I've done a couple of times. And I've seen other people doing it and getting like emoji responses. And I'm still waiting from Friday. And I'm like... 
Mm -hmm. <clears throat> just send this DM. I'm de basically DMing the guy who plays Holloway to ask for help. Said them. Dab a doob down. Got to break into the law. Click. I don't do clicks. I don't do clicks in real life, and I certainly don't do them in my RP. Zero interest in clicks. You do get that a lot in RP, though. You get people that just role play with their mates, and I, I think it's very unhealthy. Hey, Absarute. Thank you for the follow. Welcome on in to Scooter Brown. I don't know how long my potates are going to take. Hopefully not anything like 20 minutes. The compartmentalization of people and ideas makes everything better. <laughs> it does. You're right. Sorry, I forget. I only want to role play with my friends. Come on, let's get a little... I want a jaunty tune. Man, on, let's get maybe... There we go. Uh, oh, that guy's starting to harvest. Okay, so we can't be... We can't be that far behind. Just look at Echo Chambers. So good for the world as a whole. I'll be honest, chat. I'm kind of, I'm kind of surprised how much people have been digging these RP streams. Like, the average for these streams is kind of hitting about 50, and I'm like, this is just supposed to be a stupid alt channel. If this channel ends up being partnered as well, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> I'm just gonna cry. <laughs> We're sorry we enjoy your content. Good! I should hope so, Tyrion. I heard stupid old channel. It is funny though, because half the reason I don't want to do this on the main channel is because we were talking about it a little bit in um in Discord last night, but like these streams can fuck with the stats and stuff so much and like because you know i want to be able to go to sponsors and be like hey here's my my ccv is 100 plus or whatever so if red dead streams end up dragging that down i don't want it to fuck around with it but equally i love what i mean i guess what might happen in the future is i end up moving these streams exactly as they are across to the variety channel but under the same rules, like no cam, no fancy intro stuff, no nonsense. But we shall see. But these streams are going to be sporadic, right? Like I've got time this week. Next week, I've been looking at it. I'm like, I genuinely don't know when I'm going to get time to role play next week. I got too much to do next week. Might get one in on Wednesday. This is taking a while. Oh, hang on. Are any, do any of these look any different? This row has got to finish first, I think. Yeah, this is the zero expectations channel. Um, but both Obi and Scooter are already up on the VODs uh, chat. Although I don't think the Scooter one might not be... Um, might not be there yet because I think it's unlisted at the moment while I sort out the copyright bullshit. Ah, okay. 
Interesting. So these ones are ready. The other ones are... Oh, no, wait. Are these mine? Oh, shit. Yeah, these are mine. Okay. So confused. Potato. Howdy. I don't know if I got potatoes in my ears, sir. I can't hear a word you're saying. You gotta get those potatoes at your ear. Oh, I can hear you now. You the same guy that was out here earlier, or you different guy? I mean, I've been here maybe uh, last half hour or so. There was a guy oh, over there. Uh, oh, he's still there. I can see him all in black by the water towers. Yeah, that's not scary at all. Are you looking for Scooter? No, I'm just looking around. Oh, I, I, it's me, though. It's me, Scooter Brown, local celebrity. I know, I know. Oh, yeah, local. Uh, I, I'd say you're further than that, right? You oh, got I'm a bigger reach than local, right? Well, I mean, I don't like to brag, but the whole of Monroe, I think, knows about Scooter Brown, local celebrity. Hmm. Well, I guess I know about him now. Yes, sir. And when I start my wagon tours, you can have a front row seat. You mean it? Absolutely. I'll give you a free copy of my son's book, too. Well, I don't like doing anything for free, so I'd have to pay you. Well, whatever you feel that the tour is worth. Oh, well, I'm actually here to rob you. Um, You're going to rob a local celebrity? Yeah, I felt like it's more uh, notorious of me to do that, right? You think so? I'm kidding. I'm not here to rob you. Oh, okay. Oh. I'll, I'll put that away well, then. That, 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 that was quick. Yeah, you don't get to be 67 without knowing how to stay alive. I can't even count that high, I don't think. Oh, you got to use your toes. That's what I've been teaching people. Oh, well, my shoes, uh, you don't want me to take my shoes off. Oh, are your, are your feet 87% bunion just like me? Yep. <gasps> well, hey, mine are 88, but... Oh, that, okay, count. that's too bad. You got to keep it under 88, fella. Well, they're technically 87.9, so I rounded up, so technically I'm under that. Oh, okay, that's good work. You are threading the needle there with your bunions threading something just um watch out for the guy all in black over there okay he's suspicious why is he suspicious i mean he's he's in a suit all in black planting at night i don't trust it oh and he's growing uh moda too let's go talk to him <gasps> okay i'm scared just though kidding. i'm gonna talk to oh, him then. okay i got i'm i'm gonna grab my potatoes <laughs> I do want to go talk to him, but I need to get these potatoes before um, uh, server restarts. <laughs> I thought he was going to rob us, chat. And I was like, he doesn't have a gun out. <laughs> Advantage scooter. I tell you what, though, other than like a couple of people with with like shitty mics or whatever or like shitty recording environments which is not their fault like the rp here has been like just as good as wild see look these ones though aren't growing but i also okay let me go and grab some more water i've got like 10 minutes Okay. Those are tomatoes. Yeah, it's because the game, like, they can only use, uh, like, oh, shit. I need my horse. Can I even climb over encumbered? I can. Okay, hold on, pickle. Take my potatoes. Thank you. Oh. 
Oh, luck. Uh, I'm probably going to have some rosé tomorrow. Okay, let's try these. I don't know why these ones have taken a double. Oh, Teague's back. My son's back. I miss you, boy. <laughs> oh, these ones are thirsty bitches. Do do. All right, hang on. A Discord message. Okay. How's it coming along? Yeah, not too bad. Some of these potatoes have been thirsty bitches, though. I guess in the laying in the ground didn't work. No, not a not really. The other two rows, they took one bucket and they came up nice and plump and juicy. But I'm these ones are still waiting. But these were the first to plant. It makes no sense. I don't understand the horticulturists. These potatoes are some fucking bastards. I need maybe I need to read your books. My books are more about hunting than farming, so won't okay. be any help to you. How do I hunt a potato? It could be a whole new chapter. A whole new chapter on hunting potatoes. Irishmen are usually having potatoes. You go hunt them. Not, not me, though. I mean, they're great. You boil them, mash them, put them in a stew. You skewer them. You fry them. Oh, man, I'm getting hungry. Your sandwiches. Oh, I love a good old potato sandwich. You know, you put them between two loaves of bread and you got yourself a meal for the day. Hmm. I had an apple strudel from Adam the Time. That was a wonder. Oh, I love apple strudel. Seven goddamn bucks, though. You're being fucking scammed, is what you're... I'm, I'm going to stop pricing stuff in potatoes. It was seven potatoes. If you start pricing stuff in potatoes, you're going to go potato mad at this point. I mean, I look like a potato, I think. Oh, uh, no, you look fit and healthy, you know? For a 67-year-old man, you're you looking think? great. Yeah. Hey, is that little stream down there, is that the closest place for water? That's why I've been grabbing it. You've been grabbing it stream water? Dirty old stream water? Well, it's got the, the vitamins and minerals. No, but you don't... Okay, look, I know, I know you're old and all that, but we are in the modern age of technology. Oh. You understand? Ye no. And we have water pumps, <gasps> right? Okay. They are filled with iron and other sorts of minerals that will help your plants grow. If you've come with me, I'll show you. Okay. Hey, this is my son. This man tried to rob oh. me earlier on. Excuse me. You tried to rob him? <laughs> yeah. I said, hey, give me all your uh, <laughs> advice. All your, all your Robin for advice. <laughs> yes. That's how I introduce Good people. Advice. Hello. Howdy. <laughs> there you go. Water <gasps> pumps, modern era material. What is this witchcraft? Right, you see this handle right here? You pull on that, and water comes out of the hose on the other side. See right there? But where does the water come from? Underground. What? Is there somebody underneath with a bucket or what? Yeah. Well, you know when it rains, the yeah. water goes into the dirt, and uh -huh. the dirt absorbs some of the water, but some of the water passes through. And takes minerals like iron and it goes into this pump and comes out of there for you to take for your pleasure okay i can take my pleasure out of this pump i i mean you sure could but you probably get kicked off the farm okay i haven't okay i pumped this in front of people i'm a little nervous okay don't it's, worry you got it you got it you got yeah. it you're being Play judged oh oh Perfect. oh is this supposed to squeak Perfect farm Yep, yep, there oh, you go. Oh, it's coming out everywhere. Oh, I'm full. You're a bit messy with that, but you know, you got okay. it. Okay, go. I got a little bit all over myself. Don't worry, it's healthy. It, you know, it's good for skincare. Oh, okay. I'm going to look 65 again. Down, 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 down. All right. Now, if you pour these someone to that plant, then you should be good. There you go. It. Oh. Drink it up. These are nearly wilting. It's on. a good thing you got it to where when you got the chance. We can do some science about what happens when the storm comes. I'd love to do that. I'd love to watch. I think they'll go with the storm. I think that should be enough for now. You don't want to drown the poor plant. 
Well, Mahi's being a bit of a son of a bitch. That's for sure. I'm right here. You don't have to talk about me like that. Oh, by the way, oh. you, you owe him a copy of your book. I'm sorry? I said I'd give him a front row seat on my wagon and a free copy of the book as an introduction to the empire of Scooter Brown and co. Without talking to me first about it. Well, well, you know, it was the, you know, the, the lost leader thing to bait people into the wagon ride. And, yeah, then, I know, and then we'll do the full price stuff later on. You don't even have the wagon ride yet. Why are you guaranteeing people stuff now? I'm because I'm, I'm not very good at it. Look, <laughs> look well, we, we can advertise later. But okay. for now, how about I get you a good deal on a wagon? Oh, oh you, you, um, how did you know I was after a wagon? Oh, the, the mm -hmm. wagon, yeah, the wagon ride. Oh, yeah, that'd be good. Do you take potatoes? Hmm, we might be able to work something out. Well, this, I mean, that's that would be wonderful. Uh, what kind of wagon are you looking for? Well, I'm going to take people on a tour from like Valentine to St. Denis and stuff. So something with seats and a, a good way to view stuff. Hmm. You yeah, don't need a stagecoach. Those are fairly expensive and they're going to need gold too. So, uh, it's good. Eh? Yeah. The go gold's going to be the hard part. Hmm. It's good. How about you give me that book and you two can get to conversing about your uh, wagon. Okay. Hey, it's it pass this over. It's quite heavy. You strong enough? Uh, I think so. I've been home farming for a bit. There you go, son. Don't put your back out. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Yeah, see, I got that old man strength. Oh, shit. Okay, I... No, I... I got this. I... I believe in you, son. Mm, oh. Don't push, though. That's how the poop comes out. All right. I okay. Think I should be good now. So, so this wagon, you go, you said you get me a gold wagon? No, no, no. It's going to take gold to build. Okay. What, just gold or like cash and gold? Uh, it's going to, well, you got to have, you got to pay for the horses. So depending Ooh. on, depending well, on which state, they're about $200 for go. the horses. Um, depending on which one you get two to $400 for one to one to $400 for horses. Uh, okay. Most of the time it ranges from like one to three hundred is like the re the regular and then it's gonna take about four or five gold bars Which are ninety dollars a piece or you can go gold panning yourself um, After that it's all material cost. So it's gonna be iron copper stuff You can get yourself other than wood and you're gonna have about a hundred dollars worth of wood um, If you get it from miss B here, uh, you could probably get it a little cheaper than that at 35 cents a log You'll probably have about sixty dollars worth of wood Okay, so I'm just gonna write some of this down. After the storm, we could ride out to uh, Rhodes, and I could tell you what you're gonna need for it. Um, yeah, depending that'd be on good. how much you want to spend, I could show you the catalog, show you some, uh, show, you, show you some stuff too. I mean, I, I'll be <sighs> up front with you right now. Scooter Brown has about fifty bucks to his name, so this is gonna hey, be a, yeah, a little journey I gotta money, get. Mr. 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 Scooter, it ain't, it ain't all about the money, Mr. Scooter. I tell you what, it's all about the journey getting there. Well, I absolutely. Built my, I built my own wagon, made with my own stuff, and it, it means a lot more than just going to go out and buying your own wagon. I well, mean, I could not get, agree you with the, you more. You get the experience of going to go meet down people in the mines. You can go talk to the people in the mines. You can go uh, to the forge, go meet the people at the forge. You can even gold pan with some friends to get the gold you need. And I tell you what, the only thing else you'll need is hide. I forgot about that. You're probably going to need about 40 or 50 deer hide. But as long as you can aim that bow and arrow on your back, I tell you what, that comes easy in the heartlands. You just hit a few, few, few 50, get you about 40 deer kills, doe kills, and just bring it on by. That's the way to do it. Uh, yeah, I'm, there's also I'm a few other. Pretty good. I'm better with this bow than you might expect for a old man yeah but i certainly would appreciate the help even just knowing exactly what i got to get so i appreciate it very much well after this storm i'll meet you back over here and we could ride over to roads once you're done farming here and uh we can go look at it and tell you what you need and i can help you out on a path oh yeah it sounds good i'll check in with my son here see what he's doing but that sounds good to me well it seems that we're going to be experimenting now for science the, uh, storms yeah for science we're gonna learn 
I don't... Okay, uh, learning's a little tricky, but science I'll do. Yeah, these, these plants may, um... The storm may pull them out the ground and throw them everywhere. Yeah, they deserve it. They're belligerent little fucks. Yeah. If they didn't want to grow in the first place, then they weren't p good potatoes at all. Exactly. Dumbass oh, potatoes. You are not worthy stupid, of Scooter Brown's stupid pockets. Stupid fucking potatoes. Yeah, you ain't coming on my wagon, potatoes. Yeah, no come on his wagon. Yep. There you that's go. For, that's, See, you like that? You that's like for that? the pump only. There you go. Come on, son. Get Put your back into it. <laughs> uh, that's the disconnect. <laughs> Um, all right, chat. I'm gonna pop us onto the BRB screen. Uh, cause I'm gonna pee and then just um, just reconnect in. Potato abuse. So weird. Like, it takes forever to close out that red air mirror. Okay, there we go. All right, gang. I'm gonna pee, cause I'm I'm working. Cause I'm fasting today. I'm drinking lots of water, so I'm working my way through um, through my water. So enjoy the music. Well, who I have returned. Uh, I've also got my uh, law roll sorted out, chat. So we're all set for OB as and when. As and when. We want to. Done. 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 Okay. I'm multitasking. Look at Scooter Brown. He's such a sex pot. 
Uh, I kind of like, I, I much, the guy we're talking to at the moment, we need to get his name, but I, he's, he's right on the same page as me. Like, I would much rather go through the process of grind, not grinding, because it's not, but like an RP grind almost of getting all the materials for a wagon rather than just, oh, getting 200 bucks and buying a wagon. Like the, the RP opportunities are much, much greater if you, you know, go through all those steps, mining and panning and all that kind of stuff. Uh, yeah, look, all the crops are gone. Mr. Scooter. Yep. All they all blown away. But one. They all disappeared <sighs> but this one. We shall name him Steven. What's your son's name again? I, it is Taig. Uh, Taig. Like tiger without the ER. I, I, hey, I say it different for like a affectionate fatherly nickname. Yeah, oh. he can say it. You can't. Taig? Taig? He said Taig. You get his damn name right. Taig. Well, Taig, these random potatoes we found on the ground, we should go wash them. Yeah, completely random, not related to your potatoes at all. Let's go watch. Are they different potatoes? Not related. No, nope, not related. Okay. Oh, shit. Wait, I put all my other potatoes on my horse. Yeah, I'd right. be ashamed if we found random potatoes somewhere. Let me go see if they put them in the stable here. Go get my potatoes. Yeah, we'll be washing these ones. Unrelated to your ones. Okay, you wash your entirely separate potatoes. Fuckers stole my potatoes! <laughs> That's exactly what... Well, I was thinking of... Uh, where's Christina? She's not here, but uh, Christina, who has changed her name to Christina. I was thinking of the uh, other guys. You get my wife's name right! Mash them, boil them, put them in a stew. I got that reference in, Hentai. I don't know if you were here when I said that. I was very happy. Mm. Can't believe they're stealing my potatoes. <laughs> you were sleeping i mean that's fair that's what sundays are for I use my right hand oh yeah just a tiny issue right all right just a small one you might need to uh no i already took a nap and it I got. F oh, okay. So you clearly get more potato. Okay, so you get more right, potatoes than. Than what'd you call it? Like That's it's not good. one to one. Hey, I got my potatoes from my box. Yeah, all you need to do now is wash it right over here. Washing my spuds in the river. Washing my spuds on the stream. Washing my spuds in the water. So they're nice and clean. That was beautiful. Y'all yeah, know the spud clean song, right? Washing Bravo. my spuds Encore. in Encore. the water. I'm washing my spuds in the stream. I'm washing my spuds in the water so I'm they're washing. nice and clean. I'm washing these unrelated to your potatoes in the stream. That's good. You're getting it. I mean, words are a little wrong, but you're getting it. Keep saying it. have nothing to do with your spuds. Oh, crud. They are your spuds. Hey, what? You got my spuds? No. You're not. You're not. Okay, not much, buds. Okay. 
No. Now once your spuds are clean and they've got a shiny sheen, you can go and sell them to a man and buy yourself a machine. You can boil them, you can mash them, you can put them in a stew, and everyone will come and say, Hey, Mr. You, I hear you sell the spuds that are nice and clean. Yes, you'll say I washed them down by the stream. It's just a, another verse, but it's quite advanced. That was lovely. Here, I guess you could have these potatoes. That oh, are not that's actually so kind yours. of you. Hey, you actually have these potatoes as well, which oh. are completely unrelated to yours. That's as a well. lot of unrelated potatoes. <laughs> Blimey, I'm, I have an embarrassment of riches of potatoes. Oh, yeah, I'm my bucket. That's true. And your bucket, yep. Yeah. Oh, thank you, gentlemen. I am full of potatoes. Also full of shit, uh, potatoes. Yes, I mean, that's true. I am backed up to the gills. The gills are backed up. Yep. Oh, I'm so heavy, I can't get up this tiny hill. Don't slip now, you have brittle bones. Here you go, fake pickle. Have my potatoes. There we go. I am a spry young man once again. All right. That was very good farming. Clearly, your muscle memories. I've learned so much. What is your name, actually? What's more to learn? Uh, uh, Pablo. Pablo? You sounded very uh, strained by saying that. Is that your real name? No. <gasps> I'm shooketh. A liar? A in liar. our midst? Yep. That's me. You know what we used to do with liars back where I'm from? I mean, no, that's what we used to do with people oh, who don't butter the their bread. Up. Look, look, you see that bird? You see the bird? Wait, which bird? The one right there. Is it Pete? Is that Peter? Oh, no, wait, Peter's dead. There's a skeeter. Oh, that was Pete. Well, you know, I, his, in his passing, it's his formal name, Peter Peter Von Ravensworth. Oh, I see. It's his full name. Yeah, you know, can't speak ill of the dead. I understand. <laughs> All right, you two said something about a wagon and gold, I heard. Yeah, Pablo here was going to give me a shopping list. Yep. Hold on, I got I got uh, let me fix my right hand real quick. I got, I got a little issue with it. Yeah, he was having muscle spasms, you know. Oh, that's, that's bad. It's probably from all the spuds. He's got arthritis. You probably have that yourself. Oh, yeah. Like 96% of my body. 96? It's, I'm surprised you're even standing. Well, that's the power of will. Power of will? Yeah, Will. You know Will? Will. Uh, I know Will, but not Will. Well, Will, yeah. I'll put him here right next to my whip. <laughs> oh. A whip? I don't have a whip myself. It's, I mean, it, you know, for like dealing with horses and bulls, you whip. You ever had apple, apple pies with whipped cream? Yeah. Why are you saying oh, it weird, though? It's whipped cream. What's wrong with you? No, no, no. It's whipped yeah, what's cream. wrong with you? Yeah, come on, man. It's whipped cream. Down in Ireland, we say whipped. It's weird. Why are you pronouncing the H? Hey, because that looks I'm like Irish. my good friend Will. Oh, is that Will? I think that's, I think Will. that's Will. The guy with the whip on the wagon. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like a Will and he has a whip. Yeah. He uses his whip on the wagon to wheel with his horses. They're wild. I heard it's really great. Okay. Should we go to Wodes? Excuse me for a second. <laughs> Hold on, a little, little, little bit more. Like ten, ten more, ten more seconds. <laughs> okay, I'm good now. I'm gonna get my horse. I see. Come on, fake pickle.
I'm just gonna sit here holding my spuds. <sighs> Why are you making them break character? Because it's a challenge and it's fun. <laughs> Uh, look, if I can keep it together when Alec drops uh, ridiculous money, they can keep it together while we're wanking in the woods. Are you feeling good? I wouldn't say good, but okay, let's go. Uh, this is why I like Scooter. He's just nothing but unbridled joy. <clears throat> I don't, have I even got a horse brush? I didn't even get a horse brush All for right, fake I'm ready pickle. To the roads. Where are we going? Crows? We're going to Crows, yes. Oh, shopping list, shopping list. Oh, here we go. Do you trust this man at all? Oh, not even slightly. Yeah, neither do I. He, goes, he doesn't even tell us his name. He pretends to be robbing us. Look at him, he's not even on the fucking path properly. Look at him. Oh, shit. Help. Help. We're going cross country, apparently. My poor mule. My poor mule. <sighs> what they call a shortcut. I might like, say it a shortcut if you die. Shortcut to your life. Too, I guess so yeah Where, I've lost him now god damn it where in the hell you going Pedro <laughs> poor not pickle <laughs> Alec uh, we had a, a, a follower over here earlier on I hope they're still here Your name is Bubba uh, Bobalicious. I read it as Boobalicious and I was like, is that Alec just spinning up a new fucking alt account for boob memes? His name is Bubba. Bubba? Bubba. I mean, okay, that's slightly better than, or more believable at least than Pedro. I've never met a Bubba before though. Bubba. I trust him either way. Maybe he means Bubba? No, that's what I said, Bubba. You need to get your hearing checked. Well, B, spell it out for me. B U B B A. B U O B A A. Bioba? Yeah, but but there's silent letters in it, you know. Oh, oh, is silent K? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, where does the Z go? Uh, near the beginning. Okay. Over there. Now you can pronounce the Z, but it's more of a, you know, regional dialect. Oh, okay. A, a colloquialism. Exactly. Are we, are, I'm pretty sure we're going past roads. We've just went past roads. No, no, don't you worry. Don't worry. Excuse me, you sir. Important wagon either. business. That wasn't roads. That was the, uh, the farm. Yeah, Zed like Zebedee. I feel we're going to be dead by the end of the day. Yeah, I mean, that's true of any day I wake up these days. Holy shit. Just a little wildlife murder on the way. Teach him to lay in my way again. I don't know about you, but I think Zuboba has got anger issues. That man is fucking psychotic. I think I think the wagon we buy might be stained in blood of his enemies. We're gonna find a left foot down there. Hey, look, that'll be an extra left foot. We can use to count to 25. <gasps> oh, that's good. That means we can earn more money. Yeah, I think we should actually stay home now. If we don't find a left foot on the wagon, we can use his left foot. Oh, that's smart. Well, he's got two. We could count up to 30. 
two. I don't think it's two left feet. Okay. <laughs> you work around here, Bubba? Yep, right over here. I do not trust this man. You working at the forge here? Yeah. Oh, it's good. I came by here uh, yesterday, I think. Oh, it's too rich for my bones. Hey, no jump on the fence. No, the fence is broken when I got there. Oh, okay. You live right there, weren't you? There you go. Good lads. Okay, let's go look. Are we guessing Bachala's name? I'm gonna go with Anthony. <laughs> you, you don't know. Okay, so, a coach which holds up to 10 people. Oh, isn't this nice and comfy? It has four seats on the inside, two on the outside, and then two more people can sit on the sides near the doors. Hello. Uh, hello. Hello. We're hiding. Oh. Uh, are you the blacksmith? I am <gasps> a blacksmith. Okay. Yeah. Oh, right. It's a lady. Maybe you could fall in love with her. Okay. With her, uh, what does she look like? She's pretty. Okay, let me get these let, let, let me take, this lady let me real quick. Okay, but be subtle. And then I will uh, be subtle. I'll be with y'all. Is it five dollars? Hey, what do you look like? Uh, they're two dollars. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, I think that works. What the hell? Two two dollars, you say? No, oh, she's two okay. dollars a piece. She sounds fancy. Okay. You gotta play it cool. She uh, play it cool? Yeah, like hey, you wanna see my spuds? I'm sorry about them. They're they're strange she fellas. Might, she might think that's kinda that's weird though, spuds. You know your potatoes. I just found them on the side of the road. Tell them that you, oh, you got wait, your wait, spuds in you your trousers. Like that? No, no, no. That sounds worse. Okay, okay. tell her okay. um, she is a, a rose in an ever barren desert of beauty. Okay. All right. All right. Back to what we were talking about. I got Sorry. it. I got it. I got it. I believe in you. <sighs> He's gonna need a lot of believing. She's gone. Oh fuck. So a. A coach, for example, <laughs> is, uh, like, uh, let's see, a coach, which is the, the big wagon that you can hold people in. Yeah, it's sure. It's $460 for just the horses. And then you need ram hide, five gold bars, copper, iron, and wood. So that's probably your most expensive way to go. Okay, $460 Four. for horses, five gold bars, copper, iron, and wood. Yep, but what we I would need to recommend get those resources. Yeah, but I would recommend a stagecoach though. It's only two hundred and eighty dollars for the uh, horses. Uh, you can hold ten people, so four people on the inside, two on the back, two on the sides, and two that are holding the reins. And then all you'll need is five gold bars and thirty ram hides, so it's a little cheaper. Okay, let me get her her horseshoes real quick. Hello there, ma'am. Hello, sir. It's four dollars. Four dollars, yes, ma'am. There you go. I hope you enjoy them, okay? Yeah, thank you very much. Nervous. Have a good day. Hey, excuse right, me, ma'am. Take care. No, don't, don't. Oh, don't she's so pretty. Don't, no, you I should know. say something. She's getting I'm on nervous. a horse. That's love riding away. Well, don't just watch her leave now. That's creepy. It's okay. I'll teach you about love. <laughs> I should introduce him to Marianne. So, uh, Zababaka. Yeah, it's, uh, it's Bubba. Yep. Oh, uh, I, I'm sorry. I was doing the local pronunciation. You Do you have any of these in stock so I can see the difference between a stagecoach uh, and the super duper one yeah. you said? Yeah, you want to look over my shoulder real quick? Yeah. I don't know how this works. I don't know what that means. 
Yeah, just look over my shoulder and I done show you. You know, these hay bales are real comfortable. Can I buy one of these off you? I don't know. We don't sell those anymore. I, I swear I buy uh, two horseshoe. <gasps> hey, sorry, sir, but are you the blacksmith uh, in Rhodes? Or are you the blacksmith uh, in another place? Oh, I'm the blacksmith here. I sh it's second yeah, chance. Well, Go. It's open, sir. <laughs> come on, come on. I'll come with you. What, what, what was the call again? It's, you are a rose of beauty. You are a rose in an otherwise desolate desert of beauty. I got a few donkey shoes, but you are a rose in a desert of desert beauty. Okay, how many donkey shoes do you need? Well, one for each leg. One, you need four donkey shoes. I get your name? Okay, let me go get some donkey shoes for you. Adelaide. Oh, thank you. Adelaide, it's nice to meet you. Pleasure. Are you James okay? Tyke. No, sir. Is this your beautiful animal, sir? Oh, what's your name? Tyke. I'm a, it's an Irish name. I tell you, I speak. I speak to you over here. Uh, uh, okay. A -A right. I just want to get out of the way of the lovebirds. Um, sir, where did you get such a exquisite animals? Ah, uh, well, I, I bought her. I need. I, I, I'm new to Monroe. I've been looking for a beautiful donkey for since I arrived, and I was told they are three thousand dollar Renos. And Scooter Brown does not have that kind of money. Where did you get that, Emma? Uh, uh, well, I bought a long time ago, but they don't go for three thousand no more. You mean I was lied to? Don't worry, your voice is oh no, I'm just saying that it's, it's quite rare to have a donkey nowadays. And 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 and, and, and last time I heard one got sold, it got sold for seven thousand. Seven tough oh, Scooter Brown needs um ow, 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 ow. Hey help me up I'm I'm fighting it's just too much money for Scooter Brown Scooter Brown That uh, man said there's seven thousand dollars for a donkey I'm gonna never have my pickle hey, The donkeys are expensive man uh, I just wanna ride my ass uh, you could do that. Oh, oh, hey, it's okay. Yeah. Okay, 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 I got you your donkey shoes. Yeah, donkey shoes? Oh, I'm thinking. Now, how much, how much money? Uh, normally they're two dollars a piece for horseshoes, but these are donkey shoes, so I use uh, a higher quality material, but I use less of it, so uh, they're gonna be one ninety a piece. Okay, how much money? Because I can't do well. Uh, that's like uh, seven. Uh, just, take uh, off your boots. Seven sixty. I'll just give you all the money I have. And you can take that. <laughs> oh, okay. Thank you, sir. Oh, thank you. Hopefully, those donkey shoes treat you well. Well, hopefully they're gonna treat. treat yeah, yeah, yeah. You need, you need donkey shoes. Th those are those. Oh, that's the most. Donkey definitely does need shoes. And, you know, yeah, you gotta put uh -huh. shoes on. Otherwise, it hurts their little hoosies. <laughs> you don't like that. You don't like that. Come down, deputy donkey. No, no. Come down. Come down. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. I got one too. It's always good to keep. You got this, Mr. Well. Donkey. Oh, it's a lady. I would definitely it's, it's, like to know. Oh, Miss Donkey. Can I? Can I pet her? Well, I like it. I'm available yeah, yeah, whenever, yeah, really. So like you just need to telegram me the details, and then I'll it's be ready. It's okay. It's are. okay. Easy, Scooter Brown's here. It's okay. You look just oh, like my pickle. Not Scooter Brown. No, I don't my, think she likes my name is Scooter. Scooter Brown. All right. Well, there you go. Thought, stay around so you can ask for your name. Hey, hey, no, no, no. Hey, she's nice and calm now. It was very nice to meet you, by the way. Yeah, yeah, she calmed down because she liked, she liked. You remind me of my pickle. Someday we will be reunited. All right. You have a lovely day then. Uh, you take care. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. I wish I had. If I had a carrot for you, I would give you a carrot. Oh, she likes apple more than she likes. She likes apple. I will bring her apple. Where can I find you and your beautiful donkey in the future? Oh, well, I, I'm usually down in uh uh in in, in Blackwater. I I I I have a little crab shack down there. Hey, wait. Are you are you Mr. Renanayer? Rainier, oh, that's oh. him. I, I was told I had to meet you. Uh, there's a lovely lady, Marianne, by the Tyler's Bait Shop. She said I had to come meet you today. Oh, okay. She said you'd give me crabs. Oh, well, you want some crabs? 
I got, I got some fat crabs on me right now. I got the crystal. Have you, have you ever heard about? Have you, do you happen to know what a uh, pretzel is? A, a pretzel? It's one of those fancy foods you find in Sandini. Oh, oh, oh well, no, it's, it's kind of like crunchy bread. I, I, I made, I made it. I made, I made, I stuffed it. I stuffed it with oh, delicious Oh, I make bread. bread. Yeah, but is it fancy pretzel bread? No. Well then. How about, how about I give you one? How about I give you one? And you tell me if you like it, okay? Hold okay. On, hold on, hold on, hold on. Shall, I mean, I'm currently in the process of finding a food sponsor for my, my wagon rides. Maybe we could have a conversation about a business opportunity. Okay. Yeah, we can do that. Okay, let's try this fancy rich people bread. Rich people. I, I, I wouldn't go that bread. Rich people. It's just bread. It's bread. It's oh. Bread. Yeah, oh. Yeah, okay, me. Yeah, oh, that. Yeah. Oh, that's that's a taste sensation. I told you, I told you, I told you, I told you. Oh, yes, yes, yes. You gotta try this man's fancy bread. No. Oh. Mm. No, no. And then I make, I also make, I also make fat crabs. It's like a burger, but but like delicious crab legs inside. And I also make, I also make the, the crab cabbage. Yeah, mm. crab cabbage is actually more like a more bread round meal as well. And then I make crab again for cherry me. And I can eat all of that. Oh, yeah, yeah, I also make lemonade. Sweet delicious lemonade. It's lim Why'd you make your lemonade from? Oh, well, I got my lemonade from, uh, from, 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 from Lemons. strawberries. Mm, yeah. Lemons. Uh, and cherries. Uh, and black currants. And black currants. And sugar. And uh, water. Uh, oh, 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 lemons. And lemons. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, you say you make lemonade from lemons? Huh? You... No, I said he uses lemons. Oh, that's stupid. You don't make lemonade from lemons. What's she talking about? Yeah. I'm it has lemon in the name. Yeah, but that's just branding, isn't it? You just branding. Yeah. That's from Big Lemon. They don't want you to stop buying lemons. Oh, that's the part of the Big Lemon. Yep, that's all a conspiracy uh. theory. Them conspiring environmentees? Yes, that's it. It's from the government. It's the governments don't Them want governments. us finding out about lemons. Speaking of government, I'm gonna run for governor. You gonna run for governor? Governor, yep. He's getting all political. A long time ago, actually, actually, a long time ago, there was a guy that his name was Whitaker. He used to own the blacksmith here in Rhodes, and he was the governor. No, 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 I don't want to be the governor right here. I want to be the governor. I don't know what that is. You don't have your it, It's just, it's just, it's just, uh, the. The guy that's over all the bubbas, and then What's all the it's just me. It's just me. Why your name is Bubba? Yeah, so I'm gonna be self-appointed. Well, obviously, because no, there's nobody, nobody else. But I'm gonna be the Bubba and Rainier. The Bubba. Are you talking about right. the psychological principle of self-actualization, wherein which the person yep. you think you are is the person that you have become? Yes. So oh, I I'm thought the so. Okay. That's clear. So I'm gonna get some posters made the next few days. Me what? 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 It's Bubbiner. Ah. It was right there. He said it. I'm right here. Ah, you just use it all fancy with I don't even know what I mean. Yep. Yep. Bubbiner <laughs> is what I will be. Okay. All right. Well, I wish you luck. You could be anything you ever want. Could you, could you vote for me? Of course. I, I even endorse you. I used to be the mayor of Valentine for like half a year. Yeah. I just need I just need a vote. A vote from Rainier is a vote from the whole Crab Shack. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm? You, you want no, uh, you, You're definitely right. Endorsement from a lo uh, local celebrity too. Yep, yeah, yeah, I need that too. Scooter. Okay, Scooter Brown endorses Bubbinator for the Bubbiner position of Bubbinating. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> well, I can get behind that. I can be behind that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, Ty, what are you going to endorse him as a local uh, author? Yes, I will be. There you go. Let's see, I think we're on to something. This, this is it, oh, gentlemen, the start yeah, of, a, wanna, of an empire. You don't want to vote for the other guy. You don't want to vote for the other guy. No. If you need help or anything, just let me know. I'm, I know a lot of, a lot of, a lot of very important people. And I also, I also, I also am a best friend with the governor as well. The governor, yeah. apparently the governor um, is no longer with us. We don't talk about that right now, okay? Yeah, well, he, he apparently left us. Well, he went high and dry. Left us more hard kind of thing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. 
I need to go back and make some delicious crab meat. So I'm gonna let you guys, I'm gonna let you guys do what you guys do best. And I guess that is beat a bubba and uh, a drunk man and a uh, local celebrity. Local celebrity, local, that's local Scooter celebrity. Brown. Yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 Scooter Brown, Scooter Brown, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, I'm gonna go down the back water. I'll come by later Bye -bye. and get crabs. But, but don't worry, don't, don't worry about it too much, like, um, because there's probably going to be a lot of yellow. I like to yell at the lawman down there. I yell at them all the time. Hey, get out the guy, yeah, boy! Go back and catch a bad guy! I heard that the law likes to just sit on the porch and brood and try to smoke. That's what, that's right, and that's what they do all the time, and I come try to go down there, I tell them, I give them a piece of my mind, I tell you that right now. I, I go down there, and I say, get out the guy, get me, go catch a bad guy, go ahead, catch you big, uh, rubber check on uh, Vigil Mary. Yep, 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 exactly. exactly. Some, yeah, some yeah. of them, I, they so rude, they turn their backs and, and does, to disengage from the conversation. He wasn't an almond, though, he wasn't an almond. Oh, that's just damn rude, you, you know what I mean? On the, on the porch. That's damn rude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was true, but I turned nah, turn my back to him as well. I was like, nah, I turned my back to him as well. <laughs> Wait, that's smart. I like that. So, all right. Well, I'll, I'll catch you guys later, okay? Come down to my crab shack if you need anything. I'll tell you if you need anything, okay? Yes, sir, Mr. Mr. Mayor, crab man. Mr. Yeah, yeah. My, my telegram is uh, Rainier. R is in Rainier. A is in Rainier. Y is in Rainier. N is in Rainier. I is in Rainier. R is in Rainier. Okay, right so that here. was R as in R. R as in R Rainier. R as in Rainier. R as in Rainier. Yeah. A as in Rainier. A. I. Y as in. Oh, why? No, why? Why? Why as in Wunya? Why as in Nya? Wunya. Uh, and N as in Near. N as in Near. I as an ear. I as an ear. Yeah, 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 yeah. And R as a rainier. R as in rainier. Oh, rainier. Okay, that makes sense oh, now. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's kind of like my name without an E, okay? Okay, I got it. I got it. If you need, I got helpful ditty is for me is Scooter Brown. S C W O T E R B R O W N. Scooter Brown. Who hey. Well, you gotta take care now. Keep, keep you take care. Travel now. safe, Mr. Mayor. Have a safe day. I understood every second word he said. I, I know. I, sometimes when the grown-ups are talking, it gets well, a little I bit educational. Every third word, so we'll get we'll get at least the second, third, sixth, ninth, eighth. Oh my God! It's word. a puzzle. We gotta put. We gotta solve this mystery, gentlemen. Also, how did oh, it go with the hot French lady? Oh, she was great, let me tell you. You get her oh, telegram number? I got her telegram, I got her name. We're going to be going out hunting there. It's going to be super great. See, what do I tell you? You just got to listen to your old pa. I, I'll keep doing that. You know, you're great. I I wouldn't have done it without you. Uh, yes, okay. And I, a dad, good dad to do anything for his son. All right, so how about this mystery? Oh, Mr. Oh, we're looking at wagons and such. Scoot <laughs> the fucking love maker. I love him. Oh yeah, I was gonna look at your wagons. Yeah, look over my shoulder. I don't know what that means. Uh I don't know what that means, chat. I think that's out of character for something. Is this in Rhodes? Yeah. I don't know what look over your shoulder means. Is it like, is it, do I go into the newspaper, I think? You know how to look over my shoulder, don't you? I mean, I, I'm real close to you, but I'm pretty dumb, too. Yeah, you know, uh, the land of the newspaper, if you just... I'm with, I'm with, I'm picking up what you're putting down. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. So the newspaper is a channel, uh, let's go here. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Uh, what's this guy's name though? We only know him as B Bubba? Pablo? <laughs> I think I'm doing it right. I don't know. It's a bit weird. And then I don't know what happens. Do I get like a DM from him? Or is there a voice channel? 
Oh, okay. I'm there. I'm there. Okay. Okay, I'm on my way. I'm I'm picking up what you're putting down. Okay, so uh, right here, uh, if you look here, uh, so the coach here, it's kind of more covered here. Oh damn, that's fancy. But it does cost four hundred and sixty. Like I, you can't get around paying that. Okay. But but which is the better way to go? I always believe is go the stagecoach route, which kind of looks almost the same it does you could look also the same. you could also change your the way it looks you know i could can put some painting on it for you then we can also put some you know traveling goodies on the top now how how custom can we get on the paint job if, if old mr krabs is sponsoring me can we put crab shack on the side no we can't we oh, can't damn. get that custom we only have uh, like five different choices. Our painter's not very good. Yeah, I mean, how many fingers does he have? No, like two. Well, okay, we'll let him off. It's fine. Well, he he didn't paint what somebody else wanted, so that's why he lost the first three. Well, it makes sense. I mean, if you're bad at your job, there should be repercussions. A hundred percent. But right here is th this is the one I'd recommend you. You got two seats up front right here. I think two people can sit there, but um, I don't really think so. But two people can stand on the side, four people here on the inside, and then one on each side again. Holy smokes. Yeah. Okay, so I could have so like in 10, 10 people. inside is like premium seats at 50 bucks if you want to sit on the side hanging on for dear life at stock 15. Yeah, but it's going to have to be you and somebody else, and then you'll probably have two people running security helping you, and you'll have four or five, four people on the outside and you could have maybe two people on the inside or you hey, just go to stagecoach too and oh have damn some security standing on the back here and you just carry four people at a time okay i like that one a lot that's pretty and then this one here it has kind of the same kind of paint he, he's not very good our painter's not very good uh but you ever thought of firing him no we can't do that that's very pretty though i like that one yeah and we put chains here to help somebody so they can stand there okay so either way i need a lot of ram a lot of gold yeah you iron, need five copper. gold bars that's the that's the most expensive part right there that's 450 dollars worth of gold okay so i i that's mean i'm i don't mind going i mean i don't have a gold pan or and i don't know where to go but i i could do some gold pan and i like you know meditative tasks it keeps me fucking zen yeah so right there uh that's about a hundred dollars worth of wood and then that's about you know four or five hours worth of mining right here that oh, you can that's, do. that's nothing that's a tuesday yeah and then the gold right here that's the thing but You'd only pay 280 bucks for the horses and then i'd uh i'd have to come up with the rest so how much it would cost for me to actually build this for you okay well it's, it's good to know it's i got myself a, a shopping cheaper. list yeah it's definitely a lot cheaper than making it yourself uh if you look at the actual price of this most people charge uh you're looking at for the stagecoach too around thirteen hundred dollars oh way that's a lot yeah. of money yeah but you got five hundred dollars in gold bars okay and mm -hmm. you have you see you have 780 in just the horses so i if you had all the materials for me and you paid the 280 i think i'd probably charge you you know probably 200 bucks to build it for you okay so if not I, less about i need about 500 bucks roughly in all the mat cereals yeah okay i mean i mean you want to write this down real quick so you have it yeah let me just jot this down here and basically you're gonna need more wood than that too so you'll probably need about 350 wood i could tell you you need 350 wood yep. 200 iron bars 40 copper bars five gold bars and 30 ram hide okay that's 280 for the horses and what's that called in stagecoach type stagecoach two. two okay yep. and that'll fit me what... okay 
fit you that many people or if you want to do private tours this one's a lot cheaper oh actually i could charge like you know a hundred bucks for a moonlight romance carriage ride with scooter brown yeah but that you only seat one other person so it'd just be a romantic getaway for you and one other person oh i charge 300 bucks then yeah <laughs> but yeah that's the that's the that's the one i'd recommend the stagecoach the coaches are just that's the it's got four horses oh you know what that would that be one's perfect quick. for me and uh adelaide oh is, yeah, is yeah. that her name that's her name oh i'm so proud of you my boy well, I tell you what, maybe maybe I'll get you that for like. How, I mean, how old is my son? I I should know this, but it's worth checking. Twenty three. Oh, I was, okay. Well, I'll get it for you for your twenty first birthday. Yeah, that'd be grand. It's perfect. All so right. The the big difference in the the coach and the stagecoach. If you wanted to save up for the horses, that's really what you're going to be paying for okay i mean i'm i'm not gonna fuck around i'm going straight for stagecoach number two let's do it properly yeah yeah coach one is almost the same thing you just you get uh you get a lot more um what's it called uh horsepower horse yeah horsepower <laughs> Yeah, I think maybe that'll be when when uh, Scooter Brown's wagon tours expands. Maybe that's what I'll do. I'll uh, get a bigger one. Yeah, when you see that coming, I mean, you either run or go rob them. I'm down. I like it. Which is good. I feel I feel my youth. I feel 57 again. I remember when I was that old. Wait, how old are you? Uh, yep. As long as it's under 67, we aren't going to have a problem. Yep, it's under 67. Okay, phew. I almost had to scary. kill another man. 58 in my heart. Thank you, son. You make an old Paul proud. <laughs> okay. Well, it sounds like I got to get, like, a, a mining pick thing and a gold pan. Yep. Today's your lucky day. And don't tell me you have both at a discounted budget price. <laughs> I wouldn't say budget price, but no, fuck. <laughs> uh, a a gold pan's fifteen bucks, and a uh, pickaxe I want to say is thirteen. Okay, so ten. Hang on, let me take my boots off. <laughs> this is becoming a meme now. <laughs> Come on, Jesus. I'll grab them for you. Okay, so 15 is 10 uh, plus oh, 10. Um, oh, shit. Hang on. Tag, you're going to need to take your boots off. Ah, shit, for real? Yeah, I'm out of toes. All right, hold on. I, I can help. Just use your, just use your hands. Yeah, I have. That's already ten. Okay, ten plus another ten. That's on my toes. And t okay, and hang on. Let me. Here, start, okay. start counting on oh, my toes. That's you know, another five. Okay. I think. Is he in one? Hey, what? Oh, that's weird. Okay. Oh, then the then the one. Okay. All right. Twenty. Oh, carry the pinky. Okay, twenty eight bucks. But 25 with the local celebrity discount. Well, 28 bucks is with the celebrity discount. Oh, you're so kind. Your boots back. Thank you, son. Okay, well, I need to go to the, uh, where is it? Bank thing and go yeah, get yeah. my monies for you. Okay, I'll be right here. Don't let anybody take my pen and my pick. I might sell them. Oh, no. Okay, I'll be real quick. Scooter Brown's running. <laughs> uh, JYSK. Hello, mate. How You're do I trip? You're going to trip. Uh, Scooter Brown's got it. I'm okay. Help. Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. It's, I, it's okay. I got it. <laughs> oh. No. Hey, but you go. That's it. You go. Uh, take my hands. Oh, there you go. Uh, 
I just keep dropping gravity everywhere. Come on, you're 67. You have to take it a bit uh, slow, don't you? <sighs> Why? When you slow down, that's when you die. Yeah, sure. If you're being chased by wolves, not if you're getting money from the bank. But what if someone else takes it first? He might sell my, my pan pick. Oh, true. He's a pretty shady businessman, if you ask me. Oh, wait, hang on. I don't really on. like the deals he's got. I forgot something. <laughs> yeah, is it Jisk, mate? Is that how you like your, your name to be pronounced? Uh, what I'm going to do is withdraw this. Okay, I forgot. I had to get this, too. What'd you get? Uh, it's your it's your pocket money. Oh, thank you. Okay, don't go spending it all on sweeties. I'm gonna spend it at the poker table. <gasps> you could spend it on stuff for Adelaide. For uh, two dollars. You could buy her a flower or um a shot. Well, you could get her a rose. Because you called her a rose. That's true. Uh, it, would, it would take us back to my very first meet with her. Exactly. And she'd be like, oh, I remember how handsome he was. And that gentleman he was with seemed old and wise. I remember a famous celebrity. Scooter Brown. Right, that's that's yeah. a family I could see myself marrying into. Wait, we need to be quick. You might sell the shit. Oh, okay. Come on, go! Hello, help! Help! I'm here! I'm here! Oh. Don't sell it! Oh. Okay, I got your oh money. My God. You're you're a little late. Let me see if I have another one. Oh damn! Lace. Oh God, I ran so fast. Okay, oh. hold on. Oh, this ain't going well. My Fish to Brown. Hold on. Oh. oh. Help me up, please. Oh. I got my own problems. Oh, no. Oh, God, son, get out of the way. Oh, you're gonna... It's okay. It's just a bit of wisdom coming out. Oh, okay. Hold on. I'm just trying to etch your name oh, on these. God. Oh, you're going to make me sick. No, don't do it, because then I'll be sick again. <laughs> Hold on. I'm just going to etch oh, your name God. in these. It'll be a vicious... No, don't. Oh, <laughs> Oh, oh god, he's going. Go outside for that. Okay, it's, oh, it's coming. Oh. To get somebody to clean all that. Oh, up. my wisdom. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, I'm taking a now. Oh. It's okay. We got it. Oh, we got it. Hey, you can bottle that and sell that to people who scooter brown puke. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's good fertilizer. So there's Scooter Brown's gold pan and Scooter Brown's pick. Ugh. Hey, thank you kindly. You you recommend anywhere for the <gasps> panning and picking? No, the panning you could do pretty much in any lake, river, stream, goat, swamp, uh, body of water. Um, the mining though, I do recommend taking a look at your map real quick. Oh, sure. Well, look. <laughs> if you if you look all the way on the near tumbleweed over there all the way all the way west into your map there's gap tooth ridge and right under there there's a little bind i tell you what that's a good place over there okay I'm a, i mean i think my little fake pickle over there my mule i reckon he could get that far yeah i uh, i recommend the, letting somebody else take the reins and taking a nap while you're on the horse that's what i normally do oh that's smart I could recharge my wisdom. I've got yeah. I've got the youth, so maybe I'll take charge and riding over. Yeah, see, it's it's smart. Ooh. oh, it's tasty. Okay, so I guess my irons from the mine, my golds from the river. I buy what I can buy the wood in Blackwater, can I? Is a lumber yard there? Yeah, you want to pay thirty five cent at Emerald Ranch where you were farming? Oh yeah. There's a lady there by the name of B. You're going to find her and buy your wood from her. Okay, get wood from B. Yeah. The telegram <laughs> is B. B E E, I think. B. Okay, so let me get I go to Emerald Ranch and B will give me wood. Yeah. Okay, but I have to pay her. Yep. 
You okay. get a good deal. I think I think it's like if you buy a certain amount, you get a good deal. Maybe I, I don't know. 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 A showcase. Just, I got a lot of charm. Yeah, we'll call it that. <laughs> well, I must admit, Bubba, it's been a pleasure. You've been very educationalist. Yeah, you as well. You be good now, okay? I, I will be back good. for my stagecoach number two. Yeah, uh, you got your book. I'll give you my telegrams. Oh, that's, nice to meet you, Bubba. That's smart. Nice to meet you. Okay, I'm ready for your telling names. It's Bubba's. B U B B A S. B U B B A S. B U B B A S. B B A S. Yeah, B U B B A S. I I got it. I thank you very much for your your help today and those extra potatoes you gave me. Yeah. Next time I find some, I'll let you know. Yeah, but that'd be good. I'm just rolling around there. There right, you go. Thank you. Thank nice you. to meet you. Thank you very much. You stay safe, Bubba. Y'all yeah, right. y'all be good now. I don't Have know where my day. horse went. No, it's right there. What time is it? Four hey, o'clock. Okay. Come here. He likes to be called Shafid. It's his nickname. Be good, Mr. Scooter. You too, Bubber. What you uh, what you up to now, uh, Tag? I, I need to take a whiz, and then I'm, I don't know, I do some panning or some such. Uh, I can send you a telegram, but I need to go send a telegram to uh, Miss Adelaide's. So yeah. I'll be gone for a good while. Yeah, you do that. That's fine. I should probably take my son's number. That's a good point. Oh, that's true, actually. I think it's yeah. something like that. I'm not sure. Alright. My telegram is T M T M three one three one three one seventy five. Three one seven what's the number? Seventy five. That's very 75. high. Seventy five. Oh seven five, okay. And then I'll just put You'll the You'll be note. getting to that age soon enough. My son. Okay, I've just got you in my book. What's your, your telegram? It's a good question, ain't it? <laughs> I think I wrote mine in my book. Let me have a look. I guess in your 67 years of life, you must have a lot of pages on that book. Yeah. I, you know, I haven't once written down my telegram. It's because, you know, most people, uh, I don't like to give it out because of fan mail. Oh, I see. It's going to clog up your telegram. Yeah, I tell you what, though. On my way out of town, I'll ride down to the telegram office. I got to go uh, message a lady anyway, and I will All send right. you a telegram, ma'am, so you have mine. All right, that's perfect. All right. And good luck with Adelaide. Don't fuck it up. I won't. I won't. I got love on my side. Okay. Good luck, son. All right. You make Papa Scooter proud. I will. I will. I'll bring you home. A good person to stay with. Okay. Got right. speed. You too. <laughs> uh, right, I need an IRL uh, P chat. The, they, this is what they don't tell you. I don't drink two liters of water every day. Yeah, and just piss forever. See, now, Jisk, I'm like, well, how the fuck do I pronounce it? Jisk? Sight? Jisk? Jisk? Jist? 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 Let me get the gist. Get the gist. Soft J. Soft J. Sh. Shike. Yusk. Yisk. I'm nailing it. I'll just call you. I'll just call you Renier. <laughs> but thank you for coming in to say hello. I love Renier, and I'm um, also. And also, um, if you didn't twig by what Scooter was putting down, um, I also play Obadiah. My name's Obadiah. Obadiah Colt. And I was the man on the porch. Hey, I'm smoking here. You see me turning my back? I'm turning my back on you. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> the funny thing was, you were right. Like, he, he is a lawman. The reason I was on the porch is because I was waiting to get my, my badge and everything sorted out. But yeah. Obadiah Colt. 
pleasure to meet you. But I was literally, we, we were streaming it, and it's one of my favorite clips ever now because, and it's such a good, I talk about RP a lot here. Like my day, my day job is, is voice acting, so I get a bit nerdy about the acting side of stuff. But I was like, that's three people who have never RP'd together before. But what made it so fucking funny was the guy that, because all, all that happened was, right, the guy had his, his range on too high so I could hear him and I was like oh, let's let's play into this um it's the bit at the end of the clip where he then goes can I see in the menu now and that that's the bit that just absolutely made me piss my pants I was like that's such good RP the perfect little cherry on the top from the straight man in the scene it's beautiful beautiful but yes I play Scooter Brown and Obadiah Colt and then I have a third character, but I haven't, I haven't brought them to the server yet. No, in fact, nobody pretty much in, in this chat has met Heath. Heath Marker Brown, my little pseudo crim character. God damn. There we go. Down, but down, but down, down. Enjoy your luck, Yukita. Enjoy your getting your boba. Oh, yeah, I didn't wait. I didn't go for my IRLP, did I? Joe, I don't think I've ever had boba tea chat, and I, I don't really plan on having boba tea. Okay, so we did just spend a lot of money on... Uh, fact, I'll tell you what, let's, let's put the potatoes, let's put all my farming stuff in the box. Uh, hang on, I think I have to walk away, don't I? Access the box. Okay, so the seeds can go on there. That can go on there. The pick and the pan will keep on the horse. The rest of this we will sell. To get my spuds off the horse, though. I quite like, this is, it's not boba tea, but I'm just thinking of fancy other shit. Uh, chai latte, like the restaurant Millie and I went to for our, our date this week, um, does a nice chai latte. And I, I didn't have one, but Millie did. And I was like, oh, can I have a sip? Because I, I just I remember chai being really fucking nice. Uh, might as well pick up the box. So what I need to do is... See, that's like 75 bucks, actually. That's actually really good. That's from one harvest. So it's not one seed, one potato. So that's really good. Uh, that will put on the horse. So what is it we need to... Uh... So when he says a raw hide... Is that a particular animal... Hmm. I think I think he said one dollar per potato. Ram hides, thank you, not raw hides. Okay, so we can sell all of this. Alright, so we're gonna go and find some rams. It's a hide you haven't cooked yet. <laughs> Uh, do you know what, Alec? You're going to make me swap to a different Stream Deck profile just so I can press this button. Okay, there you go. Oh, I'm o Wait, how am I suddenly over-encumbered? Oh, I've got too much on me. Okay. There we go. Down. Oh god, that was a bit steeper on the other side. Fuck. Uh, right, hang on, champ. We just move a couple of things out of the way. Okay. How do I have 69 viewers? This is supposed to be my alt channel. Why is it nearly a partner viewer numbers? <laughs> For fuck's sake. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, well, somebody do exclamation mark in chat then. Oh, exclamation mark J in chat. There you are. If you are watching this and you would like to watch my actual main Twitch channel, <laughs> go, go and follow that one. You can't get rid of us. I know. You're like the sex disease that just won't clear up. It's so... It is, it's really interesting, like, coming back to a clean a clean channel by which i just mean a completely new channel after having a channel that's partnered and just seeing the the oddities with things like what you can access what you can't the funky bit rate i now get it's it's uh, it's amusing you have no idea how much i want one pound 54 to organically show up while you're doing something just so you can wonder if it's you doing something <laughs> you're glitter yeah you're the craft herpes of the twitch world that's what you are. Okay, so I think what we'll do is is so Scooter Brown's got a lot of work to do now, but I think we'll make Valentine his base because it's nice and central. So I think basically in the bank, I'm going to start putting all the materials for the wagon. But I like the idea of doing wagon rides, right? Because Scoot is a character that interacts is best when he's got people. Um. Obi can, you know, we can ride around on our own as Obi and drop him in and out of scenes, but Scooter definitely works like that's what he's here for, right? But at least from, I don't know, Tuesday, we should be affiliate over here. Um, Although, I'd be interested to know, chat. Have you had any ads on this channel i've always assumed that twitch run ads on every channel but do they not even run ads here oh okay well maybe then i won't oh see hmm see now i'm like oh maybe i shouldn't maybe i shouldn't even get affiliate on this channel then and just keep it ad free I think they might have run away too far. Hold. Because once you go affiliate, like, there's no way to turn the ads off, so... Alright, see how... See if I can do a two-in-one again. Nearly got three. I don't think that one's injured enough to stop. Yeah, that one's going to be all right. We did hit it, though. We did get three hits in. Can't see him now. Mister. Mister, hi there. No, oh, you put it away, Scooter. The NPCs will just fucking shoot you. Well, now I'm in a quandary chat. Oh, is this I thought I would died. Oops. Yeah, I think I think you have to go up into the mountains to get uh, what do you call it? Rams. I think that's where the, the natural rams are. But then equally, like, I don't think you get any encoding as a non-affiliate i think the only option to get encoding comes with affiliate hmm trixie chap trixie i don't want you all to start getting ads oh shit yeah i got a load of food and shit on me now haven't i a little bit more uh there we go would you like directions? No, I'm okay, Think Frax. Thank you. Like, from, from memory, because I used to take Heath out hunting. 
um, like this kind of area. Because I used to take Heath hunting here and he'd, he'd camp at O'Cree's Rum. And then like here, there was loads of elk and ram. You seem to have encoding today. Okay, so non-affiliates can get encoding then. So that's good. Just obviously, yeah, low priority. No, it does, Aracor. Like, it's it's up to Twitch whether or not they want to allow people the ability to change resolution. Oh, I didn't send my son to Telegram. Oh, I'm 67, I forget shit. Like, whether or not tw uh, viewers have the ability to... Um, uh, decide on their resolution is not a me issue, it's a Twitch issue. As far as Twitch is concerned, I send them a 1080p stream. Can't forget Marianne. I mean, I can. Who? Oh? We? Uh. Oh, crap, I can't. Can't read my book now. I got to get the number first from my son's. Okay, TM3175. 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 Okay. Hello from Dad. Hello, son. This is your R. I hope the date goes well and remember love is a precious thing hold it tight enough so it never leaves but not so tight that it has no room to grow your old man, Scooter. Yeah, don't go all fucking Lenny on it. Oh shit, invalid telegram number? Oh, I think I just accidentally hit a key on the way. Okay, phew, there we go. Uh, do, 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 do. I wanted to add. Where are we? Contact. There we go. Okay, so we had uh, Bubba's, didn't we? Which was Stagecoach, Forge Owner, Roads, Slightly Dodgy, <laughs> and then TM3175. My son! Let's go a little bit, Matt Berry. Why not? Could you imagine? Scoot would hold a good wedding chat. I think Scoot would be a great wedding host. Hey, office. How you doing, buddy? I'm doing very well. Thank you, dude. We are what we would call dicking about. God, should I bring Lulu to this server? I don't think this server would be ready for Lulu. <laughs> Lulu is a very particular brand of character. It would just get reported for misogyny before people understood <clears throat> I mean Millie is whitelisted here who knows you cats left you quick escape look at those mountains chat the fact that you could then ride to those mountains is insane and wonderful to me Howdy. All right, let's see what we got. I want to try the selling from box thing. I think that's an option. Okay, let's see. Uh, press B. So let's drag all the meat across. 
Let's put the gold pan and the pick on the horse. Ah, oh, we can go and sell Pete's meat. Poor Pete, chat. Poor Pete. Okay, grab the box. Because if this is if this works, this will be a useful mechanic. Oh, actually, mm, no, I won't. Because I don't want to accidentally sell those uh, those potatoes. <gasps> is that is that good, Alec? Like, getting the disclosures is good, but not if it discloses that there's uh, enriched uranium under the ground. I am I'm imagining. God, is it a track? Okay, what did I get for that? 12 bucks, 50. Okay. All right, we're looking good, Chad. You want to go gold panning? Let's go gold panning. Scooter is, uh, he's starting a new business. Oh, hi there, big fella. Let's go, Chad. Hooey! Let's go cinema mode. I love Scooter. I love him so much. He's the only just chill dude. Chill dude. Uh, it's been a while since I've been here. Is it? I think it's this one. I think it's this one. The seller marked yes on the line asking if there are any toxic chemicals or hazardous waste on the property. Oh, no. So what? Now you got to find out what they are. Look at that, though, chat. Especially with this lot on. Tell me that just isn't a little shot from a film. Look at that. Sure, I'm actually going to come across and get a still for that. Because that's just gorgeous. Absolutely fucking gorgeous. Now, we do have to be careful, although Scooter Brown is a beast. Oh, hang on. I think that's a ram. Got him. Oh, but there's another one. Did it go over the hill or did I get it? Okay. 
Got to remember to go back and get that other one, though. No, hentai. The bow is, like, honestly, one of the most, if not the most accurate weapon. Because they fuck around with the accuracy on all the other stuff. Um, on all the rifles and stuff. Like, I've, I've literally aimed down. Because you can actually... Uh, scooter doesn't have a rifle but you can like aim down the sights like the proper iron sights and they're still not accurate it's really frustrating <laughs> uh shit where's the oh there's the other one yeah like on ob i just i like fished for ages to get him enough money to buy a bolt action rifle and then it was not accurate and i was devastated Uh, they didn't explain what was on there, and everyone, me, my agent, their agent, thinks it was an accidental mischeck. Oh dear god, okay. That's terrifying. <laughs> like, I get it. Like, we've talked about this on stream. Like, I understand the reason for tinkering with the accuracy. I think it's maybe a little bit too, too off. Because I was, I was pretty gutted when I spent the effort to get a rifle, and then it wasn't accurate. Now you got to be careful here, cause there is a bear, and I don't think it's a little baby bear that kind of lives around here. I might just I might just go a little bit further down the river, actually. Yeah, not like the little black bear that Scooter got yesterday. We're talking like big mama bear down 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 by the river all right let's see what this gold panning does then chat There we go. You just do it wherever there's water, I guess. And then I think... Like, Ranch have got it really nicely set up. Like, I think you then have to take this to a blacksmith. Um, and then they can turn it into a gold bar for you. Wait, scooters prospecting. There's gold in them near hills. Any idea how many nuggets to make a bar? Not a clue. But given the rate that we're finding them, like two pan or three pans, two nuggets. Probably quite a lot of nuggets. I'm enjoying it a lot, Arthas. Like, I've, I've only really started playing in the last two weeks, maybe. I used to do Red Dead Roleplay over on Wild uh, about a year and a half ago. And it was a pretty traumatic experience. And I haven't come back to Red Dead Roleplay since. Um, and I've been finding Ranch really nice so far. Oh, God. Thank you, buddy. I like these chilled out streams, to be honest. Like, I love my other channel. I love it. Like, it, that is that is my Twitch show, the other channel. But it's also a lot. So I like that we get a chance to hang out chilled out as well. Like, you should see my stream deck configurations for the different streams. It's fucking hilarious. <laughs> this stream is so simple for me to run, which is part of what I like about it. <laughs> Yeah, it's been great, Office. Like, you know, like all servers, you know, I've got my... Not concerns, but like things I wish were slightly different, but... 
uh it's great and it, like for me what's most important now is a healthier community and a healthier uh relationship with um like between the community and admins like anyone who's existed on wild will tell you that it's not that aspect of it is not great over there and like so far every touch wood every interaction i've had with anyone on ranch including admins has just been easy and simple and nobody's throwing their dick around noodles is our theme of the month is it <laughs> i don't remember agreeing to this I feel like you find nothing of value should now become a little mean. <gasps> Chat, I should take you up to Strawberry. For those who haven't seen Strawberry, I should take you up there. Like for those that, um, what do you call it? I've never seen strawberry in in game. It's really beautiful, and I think I've pretty much decided that once we're done with uh, Spider Man, we're gonna we're gonna try a Red Dead single player playthrough. Maybe one day, I will finish that game. <laughs> hey Fletcher. Not to sling corn dogs today. I don't, I've never had a corn dog. You're allergic to strawberries? <gasps> that sucks, Joe. But you, can you have like strawberry flavor stuff, I assume? As long as it's, you know, not made from... Oh no, because it's like... Mm, tricky. What about like strawberry milkshake? Because that doesn't have any fucking strawberries in it, right? Or is it even like if the flavoring is even made with the extract of strawberries? What? How dare I? What? How dare I never have a corn dog? We don't have corn dogs in the UK. We don't have corn dogs in the UK. I'm getting no nuggets. I'm getting no nuggets. You find nothing of value could be the new follow alert. Hi, Sadar. That's exactly what I was just thinking, yeah. You haven't finished the story? I've barely played it, Office. I've barely played... Um... The single player. There is a, there is a reason, okay, that makes sense. Okay, there is a reason that makes sense. And it's basically because I didn't own the game. Um until I was role-playing in it. So I bought the game in order to do role-play in it, which means I've explored all the map before I even started playing the single-player game. So, you know, it becomes... like this. It kind of fucks up your experience of the single-player game because you're like, yeah, there's nothing to explore here. Hey, Vita! Oh, Vito, you're going to have to catch the VOD. Hi, Jay. Do you get to see the TTS messages we tip, but you're on this profile? Uh, I can do. Yeah, like I see them because they come up on the dashboard, obviously, of the other channel. Hang on. Hold, please. I'm just going. I'll just open that dashboard at the same time. Oh. Oh, this is what the TTS was for that donation just then. What happens when you ride a red razor through the mud? You make your scooter brown. <laughs> I don't even want to think about that. Go get food, words. I'm the one that's not supposed to be eating.
what made you want to role play in a game you hadn't played before kind of two things really um <clears throat> i was like essentially the reason i got into wild rp in the first place was because there were a lot of people i knew who were role playing in it and wanted me to come and join basically um so i did but also i like the idea of the wild west so it's a combination of that like there were people there i already knew um and then like the time period was interesting to me which is why i've never really got on well with gta rp just just doesn't grab me in the same way as this <clears throat> whereabouts in the uk am i from it's a mystery office it's a mystery the non-scottish welsh or irish part you bought your lunch with me what have you got top hat talk to me let me live vicariously through you all with food in a saff in it west of london or east of london or south of london maybe north of london <laughs> I'm not I'm not purposely being a dick half but basically both me and my partner are voice actors so we kind of you know we try not to dox ourselves southeast of London isn't it north of the Watford Gap pretty much every, I don't know why they're like oh the north doesn't start until you're north of the Watford Gap it's like that's not even that north the Watford Gap is not even that north I always say this when we talk about um the, you know the north is that there is a point at which on the UK's motorway system when you literally just see signs like the north like a fucking game of thrones road sign it literally just says the north they do they have cities up there no I don't know we'll just put the north it's like Lucius writing lo road signs just write poor people. <laughs> oh, these signs were written by the Tories. Winter is coming. Aye. And will you stand there as a member of the Night's Watch? Holding back that which those other people don't know about? The pause, exit 12. Oh, does it, Frax? I've never, I've only ever, well, I say I've never been to Scotland. When I've ever I've visited Scotland, I've always flown in. Because us in the south have enough money to fly, so. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't help it. That joke was just right there. <laughs> yeah, I've only, I've only ever driven into Scotland once. And I say I, that was my dad. My dad was driving, so, you know, I was only a kid. I didn't pay any attention to the signs. You stayed up watching Pendragon till 7 a.m.? Jesus Christ, Top Hat. Did you enjoy it? And honestly, if last night's D&D session is... um anything to go by tuesday should be uh i would i would worry so many voices office don't even get me started there are so many voices in my head plus i've been voice acting for well since i was a kid but professionally for like 15 years now i span up a random character on gilded actually I made him Scottish. His name was... I can't remember what I called him. Somebody Monroe. No, I don't even know. That's not what I called him. Alistair... Something. I can't remember what I called him now. I took him onto the server for two sessions and was like, No, nope, <laughs> it's not for me. I did hear of the famous Willy Wonka experience. It's so good. Who is one of your favorites? Oh, mother, thank you, hentai. Does it weird you out to hear Winnie the Pooh talking about hentai? 
I particularly like the ones with tentacles. Reminds me of my wife. Bam, bam, ba -da 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 Where's our Fifty Shades of Pooh? It's on my OnlyFans. I like Kenneth. Kenneth, I don't voice Kenneth. Kenneth is voiced by uh, Ven because it came, comes from a tabletop show. Spoonages. 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 Goes wherever the spooner is. <laughs> How many gold nuggets have I got yet? Nine. Okay. What do we think is a realistic amount? Maybe 10? Did I get a lantern for Scooter? <gasps> Did I not get lantern? I didn't get Scooter a lantern! Are we taking bets? You reckon 15 for a... What would you call it? 15 for a, a bar? What's really bad, chat? And assuming this server has the same spawns, there are wolves on the way back. So, you know. The, like, my only... Um, my only main quibble with Ranch, and this is just purely from a roleplay perspective, is the fact that when you log off and then log on again, your horse is gone. Because it means you can't really role play out going out into the mountains and camping. Because then when you wake up, you have to walk all the way back into town or to the nearest stables. And I'm like, ah, I like, I'd love to be able to role play, like taking off scooter, for example, for like a three day camping trip and actually RP that out, like just staying out of towns for a while. Must maybe make it interesting for criminals, actually, because that makes like making camp in hiding pretty hard for them. You don't remember that Winnie the Pooh? Yeah, it was one specific episode, Office. Yeah. I want you to take off your clothes and fold them neatly at the end of the bed. Uh. Oh bother, there's a famous celebrity in my bed. But literally, the fun the most fun part about Winnie the Pooh's voice is those accentuated consonants at the ends of words. Especially the letter D. It's just that's where the Winnie the Pooh voice lives. In my bed. It's that. There are unmarked stable posts you can find rarely around the map, so it isn't too bad if you know them. Oh, okay, that's quite cool. Also, welcome in, Matty. In fact, I, I want to check the map, actually. I don't think... Like, I think we found one of those. Like, it's a very obvious one. Yeah, so, like, we know about this one. You know the... You know the... You got the hitching post down here by where we go fishing, but there's also a, a invisible stables in the boat. So we do know about that one. Do you know why Alan Wake is so good too? Do you think? I don't think it's that good. My name is Alan Wake. My wife is in a lake. I didn't mean for this to rhyme, but I am running out of time. Fuck. I did it again. ba doon down. You like the New York gangster dude? Fuck you, Eric Boy! I prefer Alonso Walk. My name is Alonso Walk. I'm here to fight the darkness. Please, please, leave me be. Just give me the flashlight and go. See, see. <laughs> <laughs> I like Alonzo Woke. I wish I was a famous enough voice actor that Remedy would put uh, an Alonzo Woke cameo. Get a Fortnite skin of Alonzo Woke. That's what all the cool kids are getting, right? 
My name is Alonso Walk. Kill my father, protect what I. Have you tried hiring a PR company? To <laughs> oh, the tea, Vita. Oh, the tea. All right, chat. Just Vita and I here drinking tea. Oh. It's when you don't realize, you know, like, I don't remember Alan Wake discussing sizes of dildos. This is a weird tangent. Am I sharing the tea? That's more than my life's worth. Um... How's my Abe Simpson coming? I'm, I haven't touched it since I found Abe. Anybody there? It's like, this is someone's horse with an actual sidearm. Scooter Brown's got a free horse. That might be an NPC's horse because I don't, I don't think. I haven't seen any player characters with a side holster like that. I mean, there's nobody here getting ready to shoot me, so that's fine. That's okay. Might just be a random horse. Hello. Hello. Hope. Get panicked, Scooter Brown. Oh, I really want the trains to come back. That's what I want. Not because I particularly want to ride the train, although we we were going to make Scooter a train driver um, on a different server. But it, the, the world feels so alive when it has trains. And I know Ranch did have trains, so I don't know what happened. I don't know if they were buggy or if... People just kept robbing them or stealing them or something. It's Milo waiting to rob you. You can't rob Scooter Brown. He's too, he's, Scooter Brown's too cool. You just got to make friends with Scooter Brown. Everybody loves local celebrity Scooter Brown. Boom. Are you, we getting trains back? Yay! Like, like I say, I'm not that fussed about riding them, but there's something just so... It just makes the world feel that much more alive. Like when you see the train pulling into Saint Denis or Valentine or it goes over Blackwater, uh, the Blackwater Crossing. I love it. Plus, big fat fucking steam trains are cool. I didn't go for that pee, chat. It's time for me to put on my pee pants. I'll do what I do with Obi. Take Skewer up to the top of this cliff. Have him pee off the top. Office, does does this server have Guama? Like I've seen Um I've seen like conflicting things about whether or not you can go to Guama on Ranch. Like it did have it, didn't have it. There's crossings in Van Horn or Ansberg or something. But it's again, it's one of those ones I'm not entirely sure of. I 
All right, how are we up to? 13. All right, let's get 15. And then we'll, um, we'll see if we can find... I'm assuming there's somebody around. Uh, I'm assuming it's not... Um, that you're not able to f turn these into gold yourself. I'm assuming we have to find a blacksmith. We used to. Ah, I've never got to go to Guam, but I'm so sad about it. Oh, okay. So it's been removed so the mapping team can do stuff with it. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, the, the, the dev team here seems really on it as well. Like, kind of more so than Wild, if I'm honest. Like, there's, there's, the law system here is amazing. And I know Wild has something very, very similar, but there's stuff here that Wild doesn't or didn't have when I was there. And it is, it's the most bug free experience I've had. It's a very moody shot on screen right now. All right, one more nugget. I love that. I was like, oh, I'm just going to come on for a few hours. And then I'm going to go and take a break. And that was... Oh, we would have been on for three and a half. That's not too bad. The doctor system is cool too. That's great. Come on, one more nuggy. How many nugs have I got? 14. Don't tell me though, office. We're playing a game where it's like, well, I like to discover as much in RP as possible. Gear man. Gear man. Oh, D&D &D last night was... was as chaotic as it always is we we broke into a coffin maker's business and then knocked out an old man you know standard standard D. &D. though they've added a feature to roll 20 now chat for anyone who's using roll 20 whereby you can <laughs> you can you can insert gifts so, for example, if you have, I don't know, like my, my character, Duroc, um, has uh, a, a two-handed battle axe, right, that he uses. And you can insert a GIF so that when you hit click in Roll20 to use that attack, it plays a GIF <coughs> in the Roll20 rolling screen. So I added some Conan the Barbarian GIFs to uh, Duroc's attack rolls. Do not give this to your players. I mean, they're only going to Google it. All right, we've got 15 nuggies. Fuck, chat. I just want... I just want... Um, chicken nuggets now. <laughs> one, one, one. What have you done? Exactly what I intended. Ha, 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 ha. It does look cool though. Like my my barbarian also threw a javelin last night, so I had a gif play of a dude throwing a spear that plays when he throws his javelin. Maybe chat, maybe I'll finish up in about an hour. Go and make myself a coffee and sit on the sofa under a blanket with a good book. Maybe that's how I'll spend my Sunday evening. I mean, the fact that he missed his javelin throw is neither here nor there. He looked cool trying it. 
five hours later. No, I can't. I've got such a busy week next week. All right. Oh, our scooter's a little bit injured. Oh, yeah, I got nutted by a ram, didn't I, while I was having a piss. Oh, nice. They've improved the bandaging speed. That's cool. It was a little bit too slow. What did you do, Alec? My DM gave me a heavy crossbow that shoots short swords. <laughs> and also, just because I'm here and I haven't said hello yet. Hang on. Which one is it? This button? No, this button. Hi. It me. I forgot I turned my lights down. Because they're on my other one. This is D&D &D light levels. Hi, chat. Happy Sunday. How are you all? Push me, Scooter Brown. Hey, hey Scooter. Scooter Brown. That's it. I'll go away now. Yeah. I look just like Scooter Brown. I look just like a damn cool. But this is how like, this is how fucking stupid I get. That the, the the turning the camera on and off is a button on my Stream Deck pedal, right? But it also turns my lights on and off. So when I press that pedal, the lights come on, then the camera goes on, and then when I press it again, the camera goes off and the lights go off. So I don't have to have the lights blaring in my face while I'm doing all the role the role play streams. Which is real fucking nice. Do I want to go that way? I think we're okay, because... Uh, fuck it. In it for the RP. This is usually where the wolves come, basically. You don't look anything like how your characters sound? Fuck. Okay, okay. I think we'll be okay. To the path will be all right. Whew. Yeah, like all the animal spawns are taken from the base game, so they don't tend to change across servers. Okay, we got away. We got away. It's the downside of gold panning at night near where you know wolves spawn. You fucking idiot. My hubby's making me grilled cheese and tomato soup. <gasps> Fuck. I bought a co-op herding cats board game. Amazing. A dinosaur board game slash card game and all of its expansions. Ah! And an animal based RPG and its expansions and some magic. Oh yeah, just some magic the gathering just for you know, just for added flavor. I'm making spaghetti puttanesca. Do you mean spaghetti noodle puttanesca with spaghetti sauce? <laughs> I do not mean that. No, no, you fucking don't. Nobody would ever mean that. Uh. We still here? Yeah, I don't know how much longer I'm gonna go for. You can have maybe a maybe another hour. Hang on, let me just come back here a second. Hi! There you go. For those who have never been at this channel, this is me. Welcome to my emporium. And these are my cats. Dax. And Lola. Meow. And meow. But yes. Hi, I'm Scooter Brown. I'm 67 years old and a local celebrity. Hooey! Whereas I am Obadiah Colt. I'm 46. I'm a lawman and I have a very tragic backstory. Mm hmm. And that's a button that makes it all go away. Boo. Okay, bye! I'm still there slightly, but now bye. 
<laughs> Alan's in the cabinet. Bye, Dax. Okay, so we got 15 nuggies. I don't think I've seen... Um, I think I've seen a smelter listed possibly in saint -Denis. I also need to go for an IRLP. I tell you what. I'm going to go and do my IRLP because otherwise I will forget to do an IRLP. Uh, and then bad things will happen. I'm going to have to put on my pee pants. <laughs> I'm going to have to put on my pee pants. Doom, 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 doom. And my dress form was just delivered. Obi coat is getting started. I think I'm so excited. I must get measured. I did not get naked and have Millie measure me. I forgot. I forgot to go and get measured. All right, chat. Now we do the dangerous thing. There we go. All right, I'm going to leave you with Scooter having a pee. Enjoy. Okay, I'm I'm back. Okay, hold on. And we uh, shake. Shake and wipe it off. There you go. just found you i'm wondering if ranch rp is different from wild rp is it run by the same people so 54 agua snakes welcome in your name is terrifying the idea of 54 water snakes fills me with dread um i've been on both ranch rp and wild i've only just really started on ranch but i have played on wild played on there for a couple of years it is not run by the same people just let that silence hang in the air as well it's not run by the same people. Completely different team in every way, shape, and form. All right, let's see if a smelter is listed on the map. If not, we get to go RP and find out where a smelter is. What I, I don't even know what a smelter looks like. You got a distillery. Oh, Los Lobos Distillery. <gasps> there was a gang on Wild called Los Lobos um, who were 
I just I had so much great RP with them. I don't, if anyone chats remembers from the wild RP days, the Los Lobos, Obi had such an interesting chat with like an accidental chat with the leader of the Los, the Los Lobos and it was just so good. Absolutely fucking fire RP. It was great. Like, I would love to get um, Scooter a little house with a gramophone and stuff. Okay, then what have you got there? You got the Amara Estate. That's the lumber yard. Oh, Los Lobos is a gang for the single player. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Right there. Oh my god. <gasps> Confectionery and tea. Okay. Ooh, I haven't been down here. Fish and stuff. Oh, I have been down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a big world. It's, yeah, it's very, very big. Would it be easier to apply for a ranch up here? 110% 54. Yeah. 110%. The, the application for Wild is insane now. You have to put together a voice demo and all kinds of stuff. It's, I mean, it's, that's too much, to be honest. And honestly, having played on both, I think you'll have a better experience on Ranch. Okay, so it doesn't look like the smelters are shown on the maps. Oh, we should go out west at some point. I do like, I do like the west. I tell you what, let's ride to Emerald because we need to sell these potatoes. And then hopefully there'll be somebody at the ranch we can, um, we can talk to about finding a smelter. Yeah, and th they don't tell you why you got denied on Wild I here either. Whereas the feedback on Ranch is is great. Yeah, I would say Aqua. If 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 it's certainly if it's your first role play experience, go for Ranch. Yeah, go for Ranch. hundred percent. Wild is very much catered now to content creation rather than role play. And I appreciate I'm here streaming Ranch RP, but it's my secondary channel. It's very chilled. And we have, and we're getting great RP anyway. So I would certainly say if it's your first role play experience, go for what? Uh, go for Ranch. Um, I don't actually Aqua Snakes, but I should absolutely get one set up in the bot, which I usually do. Um, it's just, it's just ranchrp.com, isn't it? Or is it ranchroleplay.com? Let me double, I'll, I will grab it for you because I do need to get that set up anyway. Uh, uh, it's ranchroleplay.com. There you go. But let me add a, a command for that as well. <clears throat> Interested in playing on this? Uh huh. Check out. Eh. 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 Let's see cooldowns. All right, there you go. Ta -da! There you go. But yeah, it has all the information there and you can uh, go away, old Twitch. There we go. Uh, yeah, you can look there and that'll sort you out with everything you need. Do many other games have a similar culture of private RP servers? Yeah, there's quite a lot, Tyler. Like you get a lot of role play in Ark. Um, you get role play in uh, Conan is quite another... A uh, popular one. Uh, I think Eve 
my... Uh, but I don't know if that was private servers. Um, what's the one that Darkseid do that's really popular? Um, with pi It's pirates and naval stuff. Atlas, that's it, I recall. Yeah. Atlas um, has RP as well. But I, I think very much so. It's certainly in terms of Twitch, like GTA and... Come on, brain. Uh, GTA and Red M are the two big ones. That's that's fair. Conan does have a lot of genitals in it. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, do you know if they have a back end for RKRP? I know the GTN back end is stellar. No, I think it's all, all, pretty much everything I think is custom. But it's what's interesting if you don't know, uh, chat in general. I think you may well know this. In fact, most of the chat will probably know this. But GTA, both GTA and Red Dead RP, rely on a platform called CFX. Uh, which makes Red M and 5M, which are the roleplay clients, essentially. Um, but Rockstar bought CFX. It was about six months ago now, I want to say. Because they've technically never had official mod support for either of these games. Um... But, um, but yeah... So that's from CFX, both of those, and G and uh, Rockstar bought them not that long ago, which will be interesting. But everything you see on servers like Ranch and Wild, etc., is custom. Most of it, like you, there's a few things where you can like you can literally you know you can go and buy scripts. Like if you want to buy an inventory script that gives you an inventory like this, for example. You can go and buy a script for that. But in reality, having having seen the admin side of things before, because I used to be, I was an admin on Sundance. Um, you, I say admin, I was in charge of testing, server testing on Sundance. Um, you, you kind of really need to do it all custom just because of how things have to interact with all of the different plugins. Howdy! So while you can kind of spin up a private server, buy a load of custom scripts for inventory and trains and, you know, ranching and all that kind of stuff, the chances are they probably won't interact well when you chuck them all together on a server. So most of the big servers, it's all written custom from the ground up, which is a phenomenal feat. So you, like, you look at the law system we were looking at with Obi, like, Jesus Christ, is that amazing? But not only is it an amazing UI, it's responsive, right? There was like zero lag on that law system UI, which is just... That's hard to get from a normal corporate environment UI, right? Holy crap, was that impressive. Oh shit. I can't go in all the, the wrong way, aren't I? I was going to Emerald. I got I got roads in my head after going to the after the going to the bait shop. Yeah, there's so much you can do though with games like this. Like Sundance had a had a ranching script. It didn't quite work as well as this one, to be honest. It's it was a little bit buggy. That way, please. Thank you. Yeah, I think so it was. I don't know how big the, the dev team is on ranch.
Oh yeah, ish dinner. Sandinese statue is custom made. Holy shit, is it? That's amazing. Right in the ish. Uh, tell me what we should do. Let's put the nuggies on the horse just in case someone comes a robin. I can't believe Scooter has set his son up. <laughs> but like, this is why I love Chad. This is why I'm always such a big proponent of saying yes and. And you don't always have to say yes and in a positive way, which I don't know. I think people don't understand, right? You can say, you can yes and in a negative way. That's still fine. But like him just buying into this whole premise of like, sure, you're a celebrity and sure, you could be my dad. While it seems innocuous at the time, spawns all this extra role play. Like, it's why it's just like, yeah, just roll with it. You never know. Like, it's why I'm like going to grind out for the materials for this wagon because it will generate a lot of RP. Oh, this is the guy from yesterday. Oh, hi there. Howdy. How are them? All good? Yeah, you remember me? Well, you left quite the impression, so yeah, I do. <laughs> yeah, I thought that is usually how it goes. How you doing, son? I'm good. Been up in the mines. Oh, get some, uh, get some ores to to Mr. Goose. Well, you sound like just the man I need. I'm uh, I'm getting some materials together for a a stagecoach. Uh, I Ooh, pick your I your brain a second about something. As long as I pick it with a knife, that's fine. No, just my just my brain <laughs> fingers. Yeah, well, let's have a sit down up up here. That sounds good. Oh, I like this guy. <laughs> Have you been up long? Uh, the last three hours. Yeah, about the same. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, let's try. Oh, there's no sit interaction. Let's see oh. if I can fit my fat ass on the log. Yeah, the log is better. Oh, there you go. Yeah, so you gonna have yourself a, st a stage coach? Yeah, I decided I'm going to uh, offer, start offering tours around uh, Monroe in my stage coach. Uh, that's a good idea. Yeah, well, you know, being being that old, I got s information about the place. I thought maybe I could just ride people around, give them some food and drink, and tell them a story or two. I used to be a uh, guide up in the snowy mountains eons ago. That was quite the adventure. Yeah, what what made you stop? Uh, well, it's not warm up there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's true. I thought maybe you had a got an injury or something. No, no, no. Uh, it's more like the guy around the business stopped and said, "Well, Odo, you can take over." And I said, "No, I don't want to take over. I don't. I, I don't like being a boss, you know." Yeah. I just like doing stuff. That's fair. You're you're a doer, not a manager. That's true. And uh, we had this uh, scheme set up, right? We had people pay a bit extra to uh, venture into a place where it's a snowstorm. It's 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 a whiteout, and in that storm, we had a companion who was very good at making noises. So we made people believe that in their snowstorm there's a big yeti <gasps> or some scary animal. So whenever I went out to take a pee, I left the wagon alone with the people around her, and then he started making his noises. I came back, shot a fire into the white out, and we hurried back out again. And we named it like 
I went for a scary tour, some people paid up to 15 bucks. They paid how much? 15 bucks. 15, one, five? Per person, yeah. Okay, that's, I mean, that gives me a little price idea, but that's, I mean, didn't you feel, uh, you know, a little bit dishonest pretending there was something that wasn't there? When you get older, right, you realize that being the good guy is... You can only get so far being a good guy, right? You're always gonna get shot at, you're always gonna get someone trying to stab you. Always gonna have someone to try to do something bad against you. And... It wasn't dishonest in a way, because... I mean... We named it the Scary Tours. So people knew what they were gonna expect. I mean... I might have been on this earth, uh, Well, quite a large number of years. You ever... Thrown a... A stone into a... Pool or a puddle? Yep. And you see those ripples that go out from it? Yep. Well, all I know is I want to make sure that the ripples I send out are, are good, you know? And I've loved and lost and I've had good times and bad in my 67 years, but I ain't ever going to stop me hoping my pebbles I throw are ones of good love. But the thing, though, is that those ripples will thin out way out there yeah but you get a hundred people all throwing them stones that's how you it, make a change it is and I do agree and that's why I got married I met a wife who stopped me from throwing the stones decided to take the better turn, turn out of my life yeah love of a good woman will do that to you oh yeah she hired me as a, as a hired gun. She liked to take pictures of animals. And I know where she could get some nice pictures of squirrels, moose, you know, grizzlies, you name it. So and yeah. You became her protector. Yeah. She hired me for security and uh, she had those uh, art tours around the place. I was security. People knew about me back then. So it was kind of easy. I wasn't a bad guy who shot people and anything like that. But it's more like a parents. And then, and then, tell me how you fell in love. The two of you. When you spend so many nights out, you have those conversations like we have now. And no, I'm not going to fall in love with you. You tend to create a bond, right? That bond deepens, and the stomach starts to turn. You get butterflies when you see her. You lose sleep because you're not, not around. That was when I realized that, damn, <laughs> I'm screwed. <laughs> yeah, love, uh, love just like to sneak up on you that way sometimes. Oh yeah, but. I handed all over my stuff to a good friend of mine. I had my way of redemption. Is she, uh, is she still with us? Oh, yeah, yeah. she's down around, uh, I'm telling her from her. She's around, what's it, down the temple, trying to catch this, this, like a four legged snake. Uh, uh, w hey, wait, you get snakes with legs? She said so. It was a snake that has four legs and had a big jaw. Okay, note to self, don't ever go to tumbleweed. Yeah, I was telling my that myself, but... Um, uh, I mean... <laughs> so, yeah, she's fine. Yeah, I'm not, we... I'm not really built for animals like that. I get to... Well, I got hit by a goat here earlier on while I was taking a whiz. Oh. Is he whizzed in the wrong spot, then? Yeah, I mean, I was whizzing in his pen, so that's that's kind of fair. <laughs> yeah, I, I would do the same, to be honest. <laughs> I was uh, yeah. planting some potatoes here earlier on. I came back around to uh, I'll see if I can't shell them up before I go off mining. Ah, 
Um, we can go down to uh, one down. I can give you the money. I can you can give me the stuff, and I hand it over to them. I mean, if, if you that. if you got it, that'd be good. I think I got about seventy potatoes on me at the moment, all clean and ready uh, to go. Yeah, if you got all the uh, you planted all the sixty-four seeds. Uh, no, this was just from maybe twenty of them. Do they like oh, a full yeah. crop instead? I would like to have uh, the the whole of it done. Oh, well, that's no bother. I, I can bide my time. That's fine. I gotta go uh, uh, next, find a smelter. Yeah. That's next on my list. Uh, you have down in the uh, when I head back to Vantan, you have this big smelly place with lights on the right hand side. Is this uh, in Valentine? On the way to Valentan. Oh, the uh, in those dirty oil field places. Yeah, yeah. Inside there, it's a smelter. Oh, that's good to know. I got to, uh, yeah. I gotta get my stuff melt melting down for the uh, stagecoach, then go find me uh, some iron. Yeah, I mean, uh, I'm. Uh, I was looking for someone to help me gather the iron down here, but this isn't around. Is there a, a, um, a mine here? I was recommended a place uh, all the way out in Tumbleweed, but there's got to be somewhere closer. My my Amsburg. hips won't take that. Yeah. You can take these road over to Amsburg. Oh, there's a mine in Ansburg, is there? Yeah, there is. Um, top of the... Uh, right by the mining office. Well, it sounds like I'm going to Ansburg. There's a gunsmith up there I need to see anyway. I wish me a shotgun. Yes, the yeah. I gotta yeah, get a pump run. action. You, yeah. Uh, they are, um, they're nice. Yeah, good for bears. I mean, I'm good with my bow, but when a bear is charging at me, I just want to unload in his face. That usually helps it, too. <laughs> yeah, man, a sneaky son of a bitch. I was gold panning a few years back, just sifting through as you do, and then I look up, and boom! Big black bear coming right Ooh. at my face. <laughs> I mean, I guess he's survived there. Yeah, it takes a lot more than that to s kill Scooter Brown. I was telling my son this morning that I'm going to live to 172. I got about 100 and something years left, though. Yeah, well, i got plenty of time to become a, a business owner of an empire of coach wagons and such. You got to make me a promise, though. Yeah. If you gotta stay married to that wife of yours for as long as I'm alive. Well, she would kill me if I did anything else, so. <laughs> I like that very much. Gotta keep that love alive, son. Oh, yeah. That's really important, yeah. Um, what do you need for the state coach, then? I wanted to pick my, pick my brain and said. Yeah, well, I mean, you've already answered it. I'll be honest, I was looking for a, a smelter and and a mine let's see what i got oh, yeah. i need uh yeah iron cop oh copper i need gold bars yeah, and ram hearts um, yeah i mine copper up in big valley oh yeah that's elk country yep elegant grizzlies and wolves it's okay so note to self get the shotgun before i go for the copper yeah uh i do believe not sure what Mr. Q said, but I do believe you can get copper from mine in Ansburg. Because okay. the iron is deep inside the mine, you find iron. And on the way there, you find coal, you find the copper. I'm not really sure about the copper thing, but I mean, I guess there's one way to find out. Yeah, it's, it tends to be how most of my life goes. Just, you know, start doing step A and then see what follows. Yeah, take one step forward and. If you tumble on your butt, you yep. get up again. I, I tell you what, I, there's one more thing I need for my stagecoach. What's up, then? A goddamn cigar. You know where I can get a good cigar in this place? Oh. Talked about the one that makes it funny? Um, no, I just, I mean, I got the moonshine <laughs> for that. I just mean a straight up regular cigar. I believe in the. You got a. I believe you have to ask uh, Betty or Edith about that. Betty or Edith. Yeah, I think I met yeah. Betty a while, but she uh, runs a general store in Valentine. That's true, yeah. I her think her husband's kind uh, of a dick. Oh, uh, Douglas? 
Oh, is his name Douglas? Or is it Simon? Douglas is the owner of this uh, ranch. Oh, no, not him. The general store. Works with Betty. Got a German accent, I think. Oh, Simon. Yeah, he didn't know who I was. Can you believe that? I mean, they have a lot of people coming through the store now then, so... I think maybe he just forgot. Maybe, yeah. Okay, yes. I'll, I'll let him off, maybe. He sold <laughs> sold me a box for eight bucks. Wow. Yeah, I thought that was oh, a bit yeah. pricey. No, that's that's the that's the running price in those. Eight Jesus Christ! I bet they carry they carry a lot, so. Oh, that's true. It's a lot of money for four bits of wood. Well, it's six. One, two, three, nine. Six, yes, six. Yeah, That's yeah. what I meant. I mean, six. If, yeah, I mean four of the sides, and if not, you have an endless box, you know. Oh, it's just, stuff would just fall straight through. Yep. Mm, that's true. <laughs> That's fair. Uh, oh, look at that. Good to have. The old sun's coming up. It is yeah. What a beautiful sunrise. Hey, your wife ain't gonna be jealous. You you shared a a sunrise with another man, is she? No. Okay. She's not the. She's not that kind of girl, and that is good. It is beautiful. Oh, look at that! Makes me happy to be 67 and still here. Yep. I'm all creaking knees. So speaking of which, I better get up before I freeze myself in place. Oh. Yeah. oh. Okay. Stretch up. Stretch up. Uh. Okay, it feels good. Well, I think the bones scared away all of the animals down to St. Denise now. <laughs> yeah, I think so. <laughs> well, I'm going to head, uh, I think I'm going to head to Ansberg, see if I can't find myself some of them oars. You, you got the, the pickaxe? Yep, I'm all good to go. Oh, that's good then. All right, uh, watch out for you. There's a white cougar around Ansberg once you get into the town. Okay, good to know. I so found have, a bear uh, there on the beach the other week. Yeah, that's he's uh, he, he's kind of harmless. He just likes to fish. Okay. Oh, he might be like maybe I can make friends with him. I like to fish too. You could try. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. What's your <laughs> name again, Phil? I didn't catch it in all the excitement yesterday. Odin Cooperbor. That's my name. Okay, I'm gonna have to try to spell that one. Hang on. Odin. O D I N. Oh, Cooper Boar. D I N. Cooper Boar. Oh, Odin. Oh, uh, funny line. Yeah, Odin, yeah. Oh, okay. You got any of them magical powers? Oh, I wish. I read about I it in wish. a book once. Yeah, well, if I had magic powers, I wouldn't be here right now. <laughs> hey, there's plenty <laughs> magical maybe. about being here. Oh, that is true. That is true. Well, you stay safe, Odin. You tell that wife Thank I you. said hello. Oh, I will do that to you, sir. <laughs> Have a good one. Hey, hey. Yeah. Wholesome Scooter is my favorite. Well, you can't be comedy all the time. You gotta, you gotta fit whatever the scene's gonna be. I think. He is wholesome. He's, he's just lovely and wholesome. He's just love and happiness and easy going. No, sh no sweat. No worries. He does everything just because he can. Remember, chat, be more scooter. Every day, choose to be more scooter. See how he bagged seven different women? Well, seven different wives. His actual body count is much higher. I mean, they all divorced him, so... To make of that what you will. His live, laugh, love sign says pickles, cigars, and moonshine. <laughs> Echoes, cigars, and moonshine, and a hooey just for jokes. Twitch is weird, chat. My my stream dashboard says that my my bitrate is unstable. 
but OBS says it has not dropped a single frame the entire stream. And I never get this on my partnered channel. It's only on this one, which is weird. I'm unstable. Well, used to wear a belt made out of cheese, which was the style at the time. I now want that Ralph Wiggum gif saying I'm unstable instead of I'm in danger. It's just chat that's unstable. Fair. Oh, I kind of I don't really want to be riding around with all this ore on me, but here we are. I do kind of love the idea of Scooter doing train rides though. Okay, we're kind of skirting around Sandini. I'm helping. <laughs> I really wanted to have emotional damage as a sound alert, but I haven't been able to find like a really nice clean recording of it. Oh, okay. I've actually navigated. Okay. I can cut across here. That's fine. Oh, Scooter and Henrietta. Such a meat cute. Scooter needs to meet Wilfred. <gasps> yeah, Wilfred was on Gilded, right, Gulls? That was Ged's character. I mean, it's it's pretty damn good, ghouls. It's pretty damn good so far. There might be a smelter in Ansberg, maybe. Like, it's a whole mining town, so... I need to get more hooey's in, though, chat. I don't think Ranch are familiar enough yet with the hooey. I mean, ghouls. We need train drivers over on Ranch, from what I'm hearing. I'm just saying they had to take the trains away because there weren't enough players to drive them. So I'm, 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 I'm just saying. I think we even didn't we even go and get Scooter a little train driver outfit because he was going to try so hard to become a train driver. There's a whole dress for the job you want situation. I remember we got him an outfit for his um, run for office. I also want a Scooter cameo to give me life advice. I don't even think Scoot would be on cameo, would he? I don't understand. Why would I charge people for my life advice? I believe that is what people call a grift. Like when you think about it, cameo is weird. Unless you're asking for something from the character themselves, right? Because I know a lot of actors and most of them are fucking stupid and I wouldn't take life advice or motivation from any of them. <laughs> like, just because they played a character that was cool doesn't mean they know dick and or are a nice person whose advice you should listen to. Ah, uh, the weirdness of fame slash celebrityism. Was that a ram? No. I got excited, chat. Are you saying I shouldn't have ordered one from Millie? I didn't say that. We got a cameo for the VA for John Marston and Arthur Morgan from a player on Gilded. Nice! Like, if, 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 for whatever reason I ever end up with a cameo, right? It's there so you can get shit from my characters. Don't ask me for stuff. 
I'm an idiot. Like, you know, Jennifer Lawrence isn't on Cameo, is she? Because she's got fucking better things to be doing with her time. <laughs> what advice can Jay give me? Go swimming. There you go. That's my advice. But to, just to you, specifically. Boom, boom. Wonder if we'll bump into Emma again up here. I imagine the train coming past right now, chat. That's true, Raziel. I don't think I'd have time to put Scooter on Cameo, you know? He would just be, he'd be inundated. Sir? 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 Is your wagon okay, sir? <laughs> Alright, let's have a look. So you got the pay dirt supply office. Monroe Mining Company. A beehive lumber. Hansburg Anvil. Medical clothing. Okay, so I don't I don't like quite know how you actually do this. She is now here's, here's, here's what works is if you told me Donald Trump was on cameo I wouldn't be surprised I would not be surprised uh I don't have any money left now do I for for a shotgun because I've, I've saw I spent it all um what do you call it? My mining equipment. Okay, raw mutton, yes. Ram hide, no. Raw venison, buck antlers. Buck fur, that can all go. There you go. Like, I've found emotional damage a few times, but... When I mean a clean recording, I mean a fucking clean recording. I'm very fussy. Okay. Uh, ram hides can go on there for now. Don't need the empty bowl. Oh, that looks neat. Okay. Do some fishing, or what do you what do you think we should do? Oh wait, do they have some lures? I need some more lake lures. Howdy. Howdy. Need some fishing gear. Yeah, you guys run this shop. I sure do. My name's Charlotte Davis. I own the Rusty Hook. Well, pleasure to meet you, Miss Davis. And yeah, I, I know what you're thinking. Yes, it's me, Scooter Brown, local celebrity. Pleasure to meet you. Oh, <laughs> hey, Scooter. Consider your store blessed. A celebrity yeah, endorsement. I consider, yeah, blessed indeed. <laughs> and I, I will be even more blessed to buy some uh, lake lures from you if you got any. <laughs> You would now. Well, I sell them for stacks of sixty fours at twenty six dollars. Well, let's see. Um, the, the the local celebrity business is a little slow at the moment. Uh, so that might be a bit too much for me. I got I got nineteen bucks on me at the moment. Oh come on now. Well, I gave me half a stack. Maybe. Do you need a pole too, or just the the uh, lures? I mean, I'm I'm sixty seven, but my pole still works fine. Don't worry. Never, never mind. <laughs> what? My pole works too. Hey, it's, oh, I, yeah, I you that. sound you sound young, sir. You got a big, strong pole, I'm sure. Oh, he does indeed. I definitely feel like I'm way older than I am. I, I like you kids. You two in love? You can say something like that. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't hate him. That's for sure. Well, that's nice. Scooter loves love. So how about twelve dollars and eighty cents? It'll get you uh, thirty-two. 
Twelve dollars and eighty cents. Well, let's make it an even thirteen. I don't want Scooter Brown being accused of being cheap. All right, you, this, you said Lake, correct? Lake, yes, please, ma'am. You think you two will get married? Oh my God. <laughs> it's like a running theme now. Everybody asking us if we gonna get married. I mean, he's got a big strong pole. Think of what that could he provide. Does have a big strong pole. That's right. It's already provided a child. See? Sure there you go. Thank you, darling. Oh, it's a pleasure, yeah. ma'am. Pleasure to see you. Um, I'm, I'm gonna head up there now. I think and try to mine myself some some oars. I'm building a stagecoach so I can do uh, tours. Ooh, that's gonna be fun. You watch out for that wow wow. For, for the who what now? Wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. What's that? The, the kitty cat. Oh, little push the cat up there. That was a big ass cougar, hun. Can I pet it? Cougar? I I've already been married it. seven times. It's, no, that's too much. <laughs> yeah, the, the ones that eat your face off. Well, I guess some other cougars could do that too. No, the yeah. other, the last seven just took my house. Damn. Yeah. I okay. still don't have a house. You don't have a house? Mm -mm. Well, what about, you know, the the gentleman there, your not husband? Maybe he'll get you a house. Yeah, maybe. Maybe you make so such a big deal with your, your fishing stuff here, you buy your own damn house. I'm not doing too bad. Is that a strong, already, independent uh, woman? I, yep, I, oh, I am. I bought it and paid it off myself, so. That's why I like to see. Us, you see, what was your name again, miss? Charlotte Davis. Charlotte, you see, me, me and you, we're, we're what the, the modern government would call entrepreneurs. You know that's right. Yeah, they'll come for us soon, though. They'll want our money. They get my money. It's mine. Exactly. We work hard for our money. Mm-hmm. Now go take on the danger of a wow-wow. Wow. Wow. Yeah, tell me how many times a day I got to stand here. That's just mean. I'm exactly. here all the damn time. Yeah. Nah, I don't mind it. I mean, I'm glad you're here because I'm fresh out of lures. Oh, good, yeah. If I'm not here, I will be within probably a couple hours. Well, it's, it's good to know. I think I'm going to be here a lot because I got to need a lot of iron, a lot of gold, and uh, a lot of copper for my stagecoach. Beautiful. Holy cow. How much does that take, I, I wonder? Oh, uh, yeah, I got, I got a very nice gentleman called Bubba. He gave me a list. Let's see. Um, oh, I love Bubba. He's yeah. such a sweetheart. He's I a good him man. Fish. He, he stole my potatoes. Timmy <laughs> little rascal. Yeah, he's a cheeky bugger. All right, let's see, 280 bucks for the horses, 350 wood, 200 iron, 40 copper bars, five gold, and 30 ram hides. But you know, if you consider the money for the horses, that's really not that bad because it's got to be like Belgians or Shires pulling that stagecoach. Exactly. And they, you buy, got to buy them for what, 100 or 200 dollars a piece usually? Yeah, he said he'd do me a cheap, uh, you know, he put it together for me cheaper than me buying it outright if I bought the materials. So, seems oh, like. Oh, nice. Bit of hard work and smart business sense, see? He was a kind man, though. I tell you what, now what I'm going to do for you because I'm having. You know, good time here while I get my uh, breath back from riding is I will endorse this uh, tackle shop with a celebrity Beautiful. endorsement from Scooter oh, Browns. I appreciate you. Oh, that'll be nice. That'll go with my uh, best prices in Monroe uh, certification and also uh, four out of five on my sandwiches. So Four out of five on your sandwiches? Yeah, I got salmon sliders. Would you like one? They're seven dollars. Actually, I, I, how about five? Oh, um, let's see. Oh, yeah, I got enough for a salmon slider. Alrighty. I paid seven duck bucks for a fucking strudel, so I'll take five for a salmon. Just pissing my money away at this point. There you go, darling. That's, that'll keep me well fed during the mining. Yep, I sure hope so. They are tasty. Yeah, I, t I tell you what, too. Once I got my coach, I want you and the fella to come on a ride. Mind my, my treat. Oh, that'll be a good time. Thank you. It's okay. Maybe I'll, you know, I'll get one of them grandma my phones to play a little romantic music, put some lights oh, on the carriage. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He could show you his pole, he close the curtains. We'll see, we'll see, what, we'll see, we'll see what happens. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right, then. All right. Well, Miss David, it's been a pleasure. I'm going to go put Absolutely. these old bones to work. Okay, you do it. All right, and good luck with that young man. Absolutely. Howdy. So I got my my wagon, my truck wagon up at Oak Craig's already. Okay. <laughs> I do need a little stop, don't I? 
Uh, okay. Doom ba dam ba dum doom ba dam ba dum boom ba dam ba dum. Uh, okay. I think it's a bit weird here. I don't know how easily you can ride. Okay, I think you can go up that way. I need to pee again, chat. I hate drinking so much. Howdy. Because I think the mine itself. Oh God, I don't know if you can get up this bit. Is hmm, okay. So let's check the map. So you've got the mining company immediately to my. Okay, so this will be one of these buildings. No, I have it. I've only had like one and a half liters so far today. Oh, they're not even available on this channel, ghouls. Which is why I have so much. Okay, probably. Oh shit! Shit! Do you need player presence for mining? <gasps> no, surely not. And I think there's another. I think the pay dirt is just to sell the pay dirt that you get. I mean, it wasn't gold, but it's it's that's equally accurate, to be fair. No, no, fake pickle. Oh God, where is the mine here? I thought I knew where it was. It's got like quite a big, obvious entrance, from what I remember. Ah, okay. So let's see. Can I just? walk in and mine right i'm gonna mechanically figure this out chat and then i'm gonna call it um probably call it for now i don't think i'll be back on later i really should um fucking chill out and relax a little bit okay So I don't know, basically, I don't know what happens. I don't know if we're looking for a certain spot. Like sometimes there's prompts or if we're looking for a little material change. Mind this tobacco. Like occasionally, I've seen like little yellow circles and stuff show up. Although, to be said, to be fair, never on ranch, which I like, because they are always a little bit immersion breaking. Oh. Okay, this is mining, but I don't know why. Oh, okay, that's. Kind of looks very similar. I'm not sure. Not quite sure how this looks different, but. What do we get? Pater and coal. Okay. Get some Pater. How quickly are we going to fill up? That's the other question. And of course, if you're in chat and you're new here, uh, welcome. I'm Jay. I'm a voice actor by trade. And I stream all my Red Dead roleplay channel. Uh, all my Red Dead roleplay. Fucking hell. Red Dead roleplay shenanigans here at Jay Britain RP. Uh, if you want to follow the main channel, that's there. Just regular Jay Britain, where we stream all the variety stuff. 
which will be uh, tomorrow tuesday and thursday wednesday uh, monday tuesday thursday over there doing pacific drive tomorrow I'm very excited there won't be any monday stream uh next week chat so there will be one tomorrow but the week after that there won't be a uh, a monday one because it's easter and i got my kids for an extra day i mean it being easter monday means fuck all i would still happily stream on the bank holidays but i've got my kids for an extra day so i won't be back until monday night but it means i get to eat a chocolate egg so you know that's the highlight, really. Down, down, down. I'm teaching my kids to swim at the moment. This is so great. So I'm taking him swimming every time um, I see him. Down, 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 down. So I think, let's have a look. Uh, B. Yeah, see, we're only finding coal and pay dirt. So I don't know if iron, like, I don't know if you get the same material in the same spot or if you get different materials. Okay, how quickly are we filling up? Oh, okay, a reasonable amount. Oh, wow, okay. Let's go a little bit further in the mine, see if we get different material. Maybe I'll play some Hell Divers tonight. I might just chill out and play some Hell Divers or a single player game. Who knows, chat? The evening is all mine. All mine. Ah, okay, there we go. That's some iron. I wasn't sure. I did take a screenshot. I don't know if it's iron ore. Oh, God damn it, I didn't save it. I wasn't sure if it was iron ore or iron bars. So I think we have to smelt down the iron ore as well. Can you read us a page from Mining Facts by Scooter Brown? Uh, no, because I'm tired and my brain doesn't have the improv fuel for that. <laughs> hey, look, I'm nothing if not honest. That's an Amazon bestseller. Scooter Brown's book, though, about mining would just be simple. It wouldn't even be a whole page. It would literally just say, hit rock, get ore. And don't forget to stretch beforehand. That's it. That's all he would tell you about mining. Lola, get out from under my feet. Oh, get out of here. That's a nightmare. She's like, Father, what if I wound around your feet? What if? What if you just didn't? What if, though, Lola? I got swimming tomorrow, chat. I'm very happy. I'm very excited. Holy, writing these self help books is easy money. How not to be sad? Just look at the beautiful sunrise. And be grateful for having the opportunity to experience the wonder of the universe through the material of consciousness. I'm kind of sad because I should think the pool will be busier tomorrow. And I really, really enjoyed it when it was quiet. It's just easier to go at the pace I was comfortable with. Come 
All right. Let's see. Am I am I over encumbered? Oh, okay. We're doing all right. We're doing all right. Skater Brown is old and wise. Oh, holy shit. The whole bit with the letter H. <laughs> the whole bit with the letter H. It was so good. Down, ba ba da ba down, ba down. Da ba da ba down, ba down. Oh, holy shit. Okay, a couple of weeks back, Millie and I uh, had a, a, a Thai takeaway and uh, got some fortune cookies, right? And um, do you have any idea, right? Bear in mind how big a fortune cookie is, okay? Not big, right? Think about the size of a fortune cookie and then tell me your guess as to how many calories you think that fortune cookie had in it. Real fucking small, okay? Bear that in mind. Real fucking small. Because I was like, I might. I was like, I went. I was quite hungry after D and D, and I was like, oh, maybe I'll just have a fortune cookie as a little snag. I mean, Aracor, you're just not even trying. <laughs> uh, Three hundred and eighty-six in one one little fortune cookie bam ba down ba down uh-huh <laughs> that was my reaction i was like what the fuck i was like okay i'll have a slice of toast instead then <sighs> how do they fit them all in there they deep fry them in they burn them in A down, bow, bow, bow. Chat, when do I get to be able to raid people? I'm so annoyed that I can't raid people yet. Oh, you don't have to be an affiliate to raid people, do you? That would be insane. How are we doing? Oh, I reckon we'll get one more. One more mine in. Ba doom, ba doom, ba doom. Let's see if I can see if anyone else is streaming ranch. Okay, yeah, yeah, a few people are streaming ranch. Skip a dab, do ba dab, ba doom. Oh, interesting. Okay, so there's there's streamers that use Ranch RP all one word, and then there's streamers that use Ranch RP not all one word, like me. Okay. Boom. Nez is streaming right now. Is Nez still um role playing? Bam, 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 bam. It's playing on high stakes right now. What, you mean you want me to take my audience to a competitor server? Ugh. Ugh. Oh, shit. I missed being encumbered. Uh. Oh, no. I'm just saying, he's a friend, is he? friend of who oh wait how much does my sandwich weigh let's eat my sandwich maybe that'll get rid of it <sighs> mm, nom, 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 nom. fuck off did that unin how heavy was that salmon sandwich oh but i'm not over encumbered oh okay i'm just very lightly encumbered i guess I never know. Oh shit, I'm lost, chat. You drop a little bit of pay dirt. Let's split. I don't know, let's take two pay dirt off. Alright, let's split. 
Uh, one more. I think three pay dirt will be enough. <sighs> Do you know? I mean, we're okay, actually. We're not that slow. You have Obi on a hunt for another player. And it's like he really is on their tail. You need to raid him before Obi catches him, but you need to do it. When you're finishing a scooter stream, yes. <laughs> uh, just head head towards the light, Aracor. Head for the light. Although I'm reasonably... Is this the way we... I'm not even sure this is the way we came in. But it's the way we're coming out. Oopsie. Yeah, this is not the way we came in. Here we go. Okay, so we want the iron ore. And I think if you go down here, basically, to the pay dirt office... I think you can sell the pay dirt. You can do something with the pay dirt. Your account is more than 30 days old. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, this account. I don't know how old this account is. Two weeks. No, is it one more level down? Oh, actually, it's quite low down. Ah. Oh, this is just insane, this level that they put into it. Okay, so... So you don't get a lot. You don't get a lot for pay dirt. Let's try this. Oh. Oh. What? What do you think you're interacting with, Scooter? Okay, there we go. Hi, right, Scooter. It's time to go to sleep, buddy. It's time to go to sleep. Take it easy, buddy, okay? Good night, Scooter. Sleep tight. Sweet prince. Hi, chap. It's me with no lights on. Ah, Jesus Christ. Violet? It's me, with lights on. Hi, hi everybody. I, I'm Jay. Yeah, I'm the loser. What done a stream just then, innit? I'm the loser. What done a stream? So I don't think I own any attire that isn't nerdy chat. Like I've got a Hangar 13 t-shirt on today, and my new favorite hoodie. <laughs> right chat I don't think I'm going to be back on today um I need to what'd you call her I need to just because I would come back on I would do another stream right and I need to not because that way unhealthy relationships with games and personal life lie okay it's called balance yeah right chat let's go and see uh, who else is on playing uh, ranch uh, let's see, Jay Granger. I, I'd like to see like if there's anybody that we know, like that we've interacted with, is on, because that'd be cool. Uh, no, that's the actual Ranch RP channel. 
Try to search for ranch RP or one word. See if that brings up anybody. Let us have a look. Somebody with ranch, but we probably won't be able to raid anyway. Okay, so let's go raid. Let's see if we can raid this person. Raid uh, dubs RP. Use the hass route. Yeah. We probably can't raid anybody. Uh, you have reminded me though, I need to change the hass route for me because it won't pick up. It won't pick up my um my channel anymore. Uh, because that's obviously set to pick up the J channel. Uh the J Britain carrot channel. Uh okay. Uh did a little servers. Eh, 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 ranch RP. Okay, let's go drop you with... This is their name. Right, I'll try and see if I can raid. Take your measurements. I will, Alec, as soon as I can get Millie. I will do the thing for um for you. No, okay, we still can't raid Mad Hair. So let's go do Hobo Raid, chat. Uh, do, uh, do your exclamation mark, uh, you know, raid message, prepare for adventure, all that shit and giggles. Uh, that's this is where we're going. So just go over there and say hello, chat. They're currently streaming on Rot Chart P. I will be back tomorrow on the normal channel, just forward slash J Britain with more Pacific Drive chat. Thank you for hanging out. Thank you for the scooter shenanigans. And I will be back tomorrow. And just remember, you're all great and you're all worthy. Oh, uh, wait.